Okay. I like you guys. <laughs> so. I tolerate now. <laughs> what the fuck? Same. We left off last session. Uh, with dinner with Lily, your fun little person you become a patron of. Let's put it that way. I don't know what the patrony. Uh, patrony. A little bit of shopping and some lore, fish, yeah. to call it plain out, of Val talking to his old captain Maurice and you oh, guys finding yeah. out that because of some ill ill choices quite a while ago you have become indebted to a very dangerous man the plant king that's fine so you still have most of a day until you are you have to leave tomorrow your your boat is tomorrow around midday and it is currently around 4 in the afternoon so anybody have anything else to do or we would like to skip ahead to getting on the boat um, nothing else to do. So, evening the next day? It's gonna be around, like, Good. noon the next day. Noon one. So you have about 18 hours to do stuff. Sorry, 20 hours okay. to do stuff. Oh, 20 hours. Well, in that case. It's almost like basic um, math is required for D&D &D and I can't do it. Hey, I'm right there with you, brother. People Are there... All Finish the letters and drop them off to uh, Roderick. Just to, I don't know if he's coming with us or not, but no, he won't be coming with point, you on this. But he will accept your yeah, letters and. At some point, he's going back to Damali. So yeah. Is there a forest close enough to the outside of Nicodranas? And or will Lily's parents let me take her out? I mean. Yes, they're not going to stop you. You, they pretty much believe that she is safest when you guys are around. They stop us. They stop yeah. us. Yes. What the heck? Hi. What are you doing? <laughs> You're level... taking a small child for a while. You understand. Uh, uh, make your way back uh, to the estate. You can definitely grab Lily. Okay, I want to do some druid stuff. I'll okay, uh, I can't talk right now. I'm doing druid. Yeah, I can't talk right now. I'm doing hot druid shit. Uh, <laughs> so you show up at the uh, manor and ask to take Lily. Is anybody else coming with you, or are you just bringing her by yourself? If anyone wants to come with, that's fine. Sure, I'll come. Sure. I'd so, like to be a hot druid, but... I'm here for hot <laughs> druid shit. What are we doing, eating grass? The uh, ass. Eating nice grass, eating <laughs> nice. So Val, Hexa, <laughs> and Mistress all... Are you coming with us? And all of them. And all of them. So are you just? Well, I'm not going to be lonely. <laughs> <laughs> so the party heads. To Everyone the else leaves. And Lily is excited to see you all again. And excuse me. Uh, she goes willingly with you to the forest. What are we doing here, Mistress? Or Fluffy? Sorry, she calls you Fluffy. Yes, yeah, yeah, she does. Um... Cannon, right? Some people. <laughs> I have so many voices in my head. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> you have two and a half voices in your head. <laughs> you truly have like five voices in your head, Fuck but off. you're getting Thank better. You. Uh, yeah. <laughs> well, we'll be gone for a while, Lily. And <laughs> everyone else has, sh has sh shown you their powers or skills. And. I just wanted to take you out into the woods a bit. She's in your powers. Haven't you cooked for her before? I smile. Bow oh. in the background looking hurt. <laughs> <laughs> and skills. I said skills. Bow in the background looking hurt. <laughs> okay. Oh, powers he uh, can shoot lightning. What there's the fuck? A, yeah. <laughs> I don't think she's, she's ever that. seen him do that, though. That is true. Uh, she does follow you. There's about a forest, probably about 30 minutes outside the... Uh, perimeter of the city that would work for what you're looking for. Okay. Um, I'm going to transform into a bear and then like get down so that she can climb up. Uh, she does so very happily seeing your... Are you a normal brown bear now or are you just still your fey bear? No, still fey bear. So she climbs up onto the large brown bear with these red stripes going through its fur. Um... That's all I really have planned. Like, I was just gonna take her through a stroll in the woods. She does so. Callisto 
going back down onto all fours and walking with you through the woods. The safest stroll in the world, considering all of you are with me. Um, what time of day is it? It's probably sunset. It's your sunset okay. while you're in the woods. Okay, that's cool. Yeah. So it is a beautiful walk. And crickets start to chirp. Some birds There's are starting just to some, down. Just some nice bonding time before we are away f for potentially for a long ever. time. How long do you think you guys will be gone for this time? I am a bear. I can't speak for myself. Might be a while. Here, I'll translate for her. I'm gonna Might be a while. Little bit normal distributions. You're gonna what? I'm gonna teach Lily about normal distributions and be like, well, we probably should be. <laughs> She's a She's no one to tell her this. Problem set. Problem set. She doesn't understand bell curves yet. Uh, Lily needs to get on my fucking level. I understood what a bell curve was when I was eight. My birthday. Wow. My birthday is in about a well, month and a half. Well, my father's think you guys make it back so. by then. In a what? Month and a half. Yeah. Month and a half? Probably not. I'm gonna be real with you. Um, <laughs> we'll send birthday messages. What? What day? Uh, let me pull a up my calendar real quick. It's loading. We uh, a month and a half. Stream C six cell open. I wanna. I wanna open. pull everyone to the side. You know, we, ah! can stay, we can stay for a month and a half, right? For a whole month and a half? I mean, we could. I don't know if we could can stay I get, for a month Do you think I... Well, well, why not? Are people looking for us actively? Then we could it. But I mean, there is one quite dangerous man on his way, apparently, to Nicodronus, oh. either for me or for the man locked up in jail here. Yeah, that There's would be good. There's also the matter of the Myriad, who really don't like us now. And uh, also, they're, they're there's gonna the Blank no King. Where we go. Oh, I could call in a favor. Well, they're not the Feywild. That would be wild. Fey they would be Feywild. Fey like, <laughs> Up top! Oh, uh, I'll hit my entire mic. <laughs> I'll be honest. <laughs> I, I would rather spend... I would rather spend less time around Lily. Knowing that the Myriad is after us. Like the longer we spend with her, the more we make her a target. I mean, you you act like they don't already know that she would be our soft spot. They might. Five weeks, three days, so 38 days until her birthday. But if we spend a month with her, they can take us and her at the same time. I mean, I would rather that than just her. I feel like they would come after us first until we... Prove that we're a little more dangerous than that. There's a mobile target, man. She's the she's the easy one. I'm just saying, I'm not happy about it, but when it comes to stealing away kids, it's what I did. I understand. It is apparently what they do. And they're quite good at it. Lily's listening in on all of this, not comprehending oh, no. any of it, but like... Also, you're probably talking in hushed tones, so she's not hearing every word, but she is seeing that all of them and Val are in like, a semi-serious discussion. There's not a lot of good options, all of them. Either we stay and they come and she's in danger, or we leave and they possibly come while we're gone and she's in danger, but... I think if we take the fight to them... By leaving and tracking and getting better, we can stop it. Also, the last you did learn, all of them, is they did not know of her. The person who did know of her did not share the information. Right, and last, last I heard, at this point, we've been back here a few times now. Yeah. yeah. So I'm, but I'm assuming they know now. Let's worry about that in a few hours. Let's enjoy our time with her first. You enjoy your nice uh, walk by moonlight and or sunset and moonlight. You eventually make your way back to the city. The guards don't really question it. They're not that strict here, Nicodronus, with who comes and goes. Uh, you return her to her thing. Also, isn't there still a tower in her yard? 
Yes. This doesn't last that long. 12 hours. Last for 12 hours. Um, I could dismiss it just because yeah. of how magic works, probably. But I don't wanna, so. <laughs> there's a huge tower. So, yeah, there's a. There's a huge tower. Is there any reason to? I mean, it's probably uh, like four hours left till it's gone. But yeah. Also, saying, but is, was there any reason to dismiss it? Uh, no, sir. This is probably gonna be the last time we see Lily before we leave, right? Yeah. Because we're probably. going shopping tomorrow. Yeah. Before we leave the manor, I'll reach into not the bag of holding, but like one of my little bags, and I'll pull out a two dragon teeth. You better not be giving her drugs. I know she's going to be an adventurer, <laughs> but she don't need to be going on trips. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to give her an entire dose of, uh, no. Uh, no. This is some really good suit, Lily. You smoke it? No. G give it a look, Hua. I sold it's, all that. It's yeah. basically just dippable heroin. I sold it all. But no, I pull out two that dragon is, that teeth. That is right, kid. We are out here giving children and giving heroin to kids. We're <laughs> giving dragon teeth to children. I pull we out two good, dragon we teeth are and have scrimshaw all over yes. them. Heavy are air quotes. down in front of Lily. Are these your two? Yes. These are my two. With the scrimshaw of how we the two roughly teeth. killed them. The adventures we were on. I think you're down in front of Lily. She looks so at them in hand. Okay. Looks in her hands. I place them in her hand. They are I'd like, massive in her hands. Yeah, and I'd hold my hands around hers and I'd say, hold on to these. As long as you have these, we're with you. But these are very important to me, and I do want them back at some point, okay? I'll keep them safe. And she likes so hugs them to her chest. I will come back for them. He nods. As long as you have them, know that we will be back at some point. She smiles and just nods and looks up at you with like a little bit of regret and a little bit like she already misses you, but happy that she has a promise of you coming back. Oh, don't make me cry! <laughs> <laughs> my, my inner DM was... now tells me to kill Bo at sea so he can never fill the promise. Uh, I'm what banking on it. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna turn to Mistress and hand her the books that I grabbed for her. Those are what Lydia. books? I will add them. What books? And say to her that maybe. I'm still there, by the way. No, this is your back. back. You're back at the Okay, mansion, we're, we're back. So we're back now. <laughs> I mean, Maybe ten, you could have walked. Lily that far. could learn how to cook. Also, if you wanted to give her one of these, you say what? Maybe Lily could learn how to cook. Also, if you want to give her one, is one of the ones I bought the rest of the cookbooks. Wait, pasta's doubled. Is it? Yeah. Okay, then give me a second to grab, put the other one in there. Love pasta. There was only one that I didn't buy. No, there was two that you didn't buy. Oh. Because you didn't buy the magical one and you didn't buy the soup. No, you bought the soup. You didn't buy the soups, right? Uh. You bought soup. I bought the game and the pasta. I didn't yeah, buy the didn't fancy buy the one. Or the soup. And, um. Come on. No, I have them marked for what was bought because Trey was DMing me during while it was happening. Mm -hmm. So I just I power us pasta over. will give her my first cookbook, oh. which is the curry cookbook. Uh, uh oh, we're getting real, guys. I expect <laughs> I expect to have some great curry wherever I come back, and for Lily to be able to kick my ass. Who do you say this to? The people who take care no, of I'm her? I'm saying to Mistress. Oh. <laughs> like, I, I want her to kick my ass the way that that curry does. I have to now make a new tab for Lily's cookbooks. Because, you know, that's a thing. <laughs> so she starts with the chef feet. <laughs> oh my god, this, this PC is going to be so powerful. <laughs> One level in everything. Okay. 
One second as I... Would I still have my, like, original cooking utensils? Uh, she's at a manor. She has more than plenty to cook with. Fair. She, she lives in a mansion, so yeah, she, she, she doesn't and really... she doesn't need this cookbook either. She has better equipment than you do. I mean, she doesn't need the cookbook. They could have people cook for her or show her, but also... It's, it's the exact recipes that yeah, Mistress has been using. But the night passes on. Uh, Lily eventually has to be excused and go to bed because it is currently a school night for her. So they take her and send her to bed and wish you all well on your journey. Um... So what are, you, are you just sleeping the night? Anybody want to do something tonight? I'm not doing anything. Nope. Uh, I plan on just being in my spot. Unless not even drinking. Um, no, long, I might have a few drinks. How long would it take me to make a drug run? Um, Didn't you just sell them all? Nah, look, he's got to go to Walgreens. Different Calm drugs. <laughs> uh, no, I sold all the trees. I sold all the trees. <laughs> uh, Nakua. Nakua. Yeah. Oh. He These just needs like guys. Adderall and stuff. Yeah, exactly. He he needs the uppers, not the downers. Adderall, wait, why'd I go to Adderall Advil? <laughs> uh, ADHD <laughs> kicking in. <laughs> I mean, isn't isn't that like his drug of choice though, is an upper? I'm sorry, Bill, I just saw that. No, um, you're good. Uh make an investigation check. That'll tell me how long it takes you to make your run. <laughs> Uh, you are seeing our splash screen? Yeah, that tells you where we're at uh, in the year, where Ooh, we're at an uh, old objective. geopolitically, really? uh, also what we're doing. Really? I wasted wow. a natural 20 <laughs> on freaking <laughs> on investigation drugs. check. You're about to find great drugs. Well, thankfully for you, Jar, are you all of our episodes you? are on YouTube. Yes. No, what? No. I walk out of the tavern and run into a guy that I know sells drugs. Uh, the guy actually comes to you. You uh, find him oh. at the tavern. <laughs> and he walks in and he orders a drink. And you, you recognize yeah. him as somebody who sells some. Um, you have the chart. Uh, right, that's buried somewhere. Um, I'll call him over to the table and just ask him uh, what your inventory look like. Uh, is it it's literally under the folder that says drugs, man. No, the how folder. much do you have? Uh, do you need a little more? Oh, you're, you're looking to sell? I have a little bit I'm trying to offload. I mean, I have a little bit on hand. I can buy off of you anything big. I would need to probably go to uh, money. He pretty much tells you that if he only has a couple hundred on hand. So if you have anything... A lot. It's then. just, it's just four, four doses. It's not a lot. What the grade do you have? It's a mix, good, average, poor. All in all, it's about uh, a little over two hundred. I'll buy it. That's what I would. I'll buy it off of you for one fifty. I need to still make a profit. Deal. This is all in very hushed tones in a corner of the tavern. Exchange is made. Look at you guys going drug free 31 sessions in. Right? I mean, we still drank. That's. Uh, okay, drug. that's fair. So, wait, both of you are off drugs now? I've, I've I been off drugs for a while. I haven't taken any sued in. in Since the last time you drowned? No. It, no, it's been after that. It was down in the. Uh, when we fought the blue dragon? Oh. I thought you took one before you fought Barn, too. No, I didn't take any before I fought Barn. I was completely sober going into that. Nice. And when we were exploring the blue dragon's lair, I think right after we almost fell into the quicksand. Yeah. <laughs> like, I just, everybody was looting, and I just sat down and said, Nope, <laughs> screw this. Yeah, I remember I that. need a hit. Yeah. And that was the last time. Because then we got to Puerto Mali, and we fought Barn, and I saw... Sister laser focused. Yeah, you started getting your dreams and all the other things, and you're like, I need to not be a. Yeah. Um, so you get the 150 gold. He smiles and 
goes on to drink extravagantly for the night because, you know, he's got a little more inventory in his pocket to sell now. A little bit. It was, um... It's... Two average, one good, and one poor. Yeah, so that's give or take around 180 there. plus 25 was like two, 205, I think. Yeah, you rolled a nat 20. That's why I gave you the 150 for it instead of just the 100. No, I mean, that's fine. I was going to take whatever you just gave me. I'm going to yeah. haggle him, but... But, uh, rest finds you all. You find your sleep. Uh, anybody want to do anything before you actually wake up the next morning? I know JR's copied all of her souls copied all of his spells, so. True. Uh, sleep finds you well. Nothing interesting happens. You all wake the next morning. There is the smell of bacon and eggs in the uh, tap room. What do you want to do? We should probably, Wait, probably stock up with some eggs. Not too, yeah. And Dinner. a bagel. Dinner is three silver a piece, or mistress can cook for you. There is a bagel for you, soul. <gasps> Stress. It's been a long time. You know how to cook an egg over easy. What did I You're muted, what did Chris. I what did I roll yesterday, or last time that Pancakes. got a- Pancakes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, sure, I'll- You know how to Is cook that... one over easy. Do I? Uh, wisdom or intelligence, Jake? Uh, wisdom, if you already made it. I don't have that recipe, I don't have just eggs. Then intelligence to see how good you are at making it. Uh, so- huh? In a sister. Out are, they've been going back and forth hunting the Myriad for a while. Uh, now they're going to the Feywild to look for um, information on Mistress's missing mother. Yep. And also there's some stuff going I on. I don't know how to cook eggs. Val. Yeah, you do not. Uh, and his old pirate <laughs> captain and some betrayal going on. And the rest of the party at the moment is just trying to lay low. And not get caught by the group of myriad bandits chasing them. Oh, wait, 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 wait. That's a plus two to it. Can I assist, Mistress? Seven. Does it look like she's I mean, faking it? Like, I know how to <laughs> cook uh, eggs. What would you ask for over easy? Well, I was really going to get over medium. I just started with over easy. Like, you know how to cook over easy, right? Cool. Make them over medium. Uh, make an intelligence check. Or, no, you already know how to make eggs from your time. Make it. I feel like if you're on a ship for a long enough time, you, even if you're not the cook, you figure out how to cook like oh, yeah, basic eggs. Stuff. Eggs, eggs is one of those like basic things that you learn how to do, and you always learn how to do it the way you like it. Yeah. So I'll let Mistress make it one more check with advantage. I'm trying to help teach you how to cook eggs. Okay. So just it's the second check. <laughs> the second one, which is it's okay. Um, a nine. Yeah. They come out, so she cooks them a little too long and it ends up just turning into a scramble. Like, the yolks cook all the way through and she just ends up mixing it and it's scrambled eggs. Well, this isn't a bad start. Scrambled eggs are a little easier than over easy or over medium. It's simple and it's quick and it works. A lot of people prefer it. But, but we'll work on it. Eggs are difficult. Eggs are personal. <laughs> <laughs> it really, it really is, um, it's all up to taste. Uh, let's move you here. So, you guys are here. You will have to be at the docks at noon. It'll be about four hours after breakfast is made. Are there any shops along the way? Just uh, like in the Restless Wharf, food. there is plenty of food in material shops. You can find anything that's in the player's handbook or any food materials. And you will be passing by the cold brew. But that's about it. So, Do we Shay. need potions? Eh. I have all of this in my bag of colding. And I haven't really known how to take things away. So you tell me what you no longer have what I have left um you sold all the giant gorilla meat that's right yeah the giant ape meat uh 
You probably run through most of your food stuffs, because that was a lot of that was used on the uh, one trip. I'm not hearing any tray. Yeah, I don't hear it. Um. Uh, mo you probably are down to like a hundred pounds of elk and like forty okay. pounds of boar. Okay. And your kraken is still there. Okay. Is that elk any good at this point? It's in the bag of holding. Yeah. Yeah, bag it's... of holding stuff. Uh, uh, elk's probably actually reaching near its end. Actually, all of that, the elk and the boar are probably both gone. Just okay, because. then I'll take those out. So it what about like the foodstuffs? Oh, uh, you're probably out of foodstuffs after all the okay. trips and stuff. So And then bear meat? Uh, feeding Callisto, you're probably down on that too. You're probably, we'll just say you're bear besides the kraken. I'll just say I need food. <laughs> yeah, you need food. <laughs> I need all of it. <laughs> But like, don't buy a hundred pounds of meat again. <laughs> so uh, much. Well, we'll be on the ship for everything. a bit, which they'll have their own foodstuffs. Yeah, not meat. Oddly enough, some fish if they catch them during the day. But um, I could. Oh, we have four hours. You have four hours. Okay. There's a market. There's plenty of markets. This is the well, no, because I have the fishing pole. Oh yeah, no. But you can fish during the day on the ships. Do we need potions? Does anybody need potions? Um, probably not. Do I still have the elk jerky? Uh, your your jerky stays. Uh, five pounds. Yeah, you still have the five pounds of elk jerky. Okay. Um, I feel like we haven't really used a lot of healing potions and. No, Mistress spends have... most of her turns healing you. Yeah, yeah, I have one potion of healing. I've got two graders. Trey? Yep. Do you have... Uh, I have no potions of healing. At all. So yes, I do need to buy some. So are you guys running by the cold brew or no? Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna go by the cold sure. brew. We'll see what he's got. We got four hours. I'm not gonna hurt. It's been a minute since you've been here. A couple weeks, actually. Spreadsheets. Love spreadsheets. So, for those of you watching on Twitch, I'm gonna put up the um, stream. Oh, for those of you watching on Twitch, hang on a minute. Yeah, you will. It's see a spreadsheet, it so it's kind of annoying to watch, look at, but uh, for each you get to see what we get to see. God, stop full screening. I know I'm putting you up there, but this is. The... I don't know how to pronounce that word, but that's a really cool weapon. The uh, bifurcating weapon? Yeah, uh, that's it. So what- okay, hold on. Before we continue. Uh, where did you put the book that Lily has? It's on my spreadsheet. My master okay. one. Y you aren't really- no offense, Mistress isn't really smart enough to memorize recipes. Uh, I'd say probably like- This the, is fair. The bottom? Because it's nine. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and there is a couple new potions, but- Never mind. <laughs> that Cenobite headband? Yeah. That would be nice. Headband what? Cenobite headband. What? Uh, when you land a crit, you regain a key point. Whoa. I'd like that. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Oh boy, can't wait to buy stuff from this shop with all my money. Yeah, with my... Uh, Oodles of cash I have. I also uh, don't have oodles of my cash. 164 gold. Uh, Jake. It's off screen now, just so it's not blinding away to everybody. What's up? What does the shadow blade? What's its damage die? How long does the activation last? Uh, so the shadow blade is. So, it, I put it in there. It's actually just a attachment to your weapon. And oh, okay. it can be activated as a bonus action. It lasts for two turns. And okay. so it's just a way to bypass that. Uh, if they have a high, you know, it's AC 10 plus dex. Yeah, yeah. So if they have a high dex, it kind of evens out. But... I mean, yeah. It's, but if they're wearing armor, it might drop it by two or three. Or in like a I'm dragon's. 
It's it's a it's good not a bad out. thing. Yeah. No. I was just curious. Yeah, it's uh, called the Shadow Blade. It's an attachment that goes on the hilt of whatever uh, the hilt or you know where the blade spurts out of any weapon you're using, and when activated on a bonus action, it lasts two turns and then can it will bypass armor class for those two turns. Mm-hmm. So how long does the potion of exhausting speed last? How many turns? Up to ten. Up to, up to the up to the full minute that uh, haste would usually ask. And how many does he have? Just one. Just one. He will say that he recently created this potion himself and he is looking at making more, but this was kind of his first of the successful ones out of the batch that he's putting on display. The other ones are being saved for other reasons. Personal reasons. So it's a... Shadow Blade is cool. So it's a prototype, you, you would say. It hasn't been experimented with yet? Well, I mean, I've experimented with it with myself and one of my uh, allies in town has used it and said it's very useful but it has a little bit of a repercussion I'm trying to take away but I don't think I'll be able to with the magics used in creating it so it's had minor testing uh, I made but a, not a lot in the field I made enough that there was about 15 of these and about 10 of them have been used to test over the past week or two guys I might have to steal from this person you know what I'm trying to do, Jay. You're trying to... What are you trying to do? Trying to angle for a... We'll be a tester for you at a discount. Give it to us for 300 gold pieces and we'll report back. Six hundred and I'll give you two and you report back to me on how they are. Done. And he'll go into his back room real quick and come out with another. Um, be careful, though, that, uh, after effect can be quite a bitch. I'll take one, I'll give one to Autumn. Oh. Okay, I'll take that. 600 for two? We just got a 400 gold discount. Yeah. He's expecting That's that report back, though, again. because... Oh, yeah, yeah. Potion of Exhausting Speed. Exhausting I'll add it to you. It's probably not in D&D Beyond, so I'll have to make it, but... I, I'm not on D&D Beyond with this yeah. one. Free haste, basically. Uh, yeah. Free haste with a much worse side effect. If, I mean, uh, yeah, free haste with exhaustion if you fail, but... Yeah, potentially. Yeah. Free haste? Man. Yeah, I, I think I'm gonna have to come back and steal from this guy, because uh, I need that Cenobite <laughs> headband. You can certainly try... JR. Yeah, yeah, what's up? <laughs> Hi. Does Soul Hi, have yeah. uh presentation? I do. Hmm. Well, you're leaving in four hours, train. He's open the entire time. So is this going to be like you're going to try and steal it on your way back, or I can't? What are you it. stealing? Yeah. That I was need that Cenobite headband. <laughs> no. Uh, do you see what it does? I, yes, I do see what it does. I also don't want to be criminals more than we already are in Nicodronus. Especially with you the guy can't. who's looking after you Lily for you while you're gone. Can't be more of a criminal, criminal than a criminal. Sorry. We're not criminals in Nicodronus, to be fair. Oh, uh, you were for about even 12 hours and those Antaro made it all go away. Yeah, don't steal it. We're not uh, criminals here. here. I just promised someone that I would, the best of my ability, keep you from doing stupid shit. All right, I'm clearly staring at this headband. All of them. When we get out to sea, we're more than likely going to run into a very wildly successful sea captain who has a yeah. hankering for my body. 
I that know. came out terribly wrong. Yeah, what? <laughs> he wants to see me dead. Not no, in a sexual no, no, way. No, no, no. He has a hankering for your body. Yeah, I think Swap. we're changing the war now. <laughs> he just wants to really wants to fuck Val. He just wants to fuck. He really wow. wants to fuck me with a scimitar. Until I'm dead. Uh wildly And then fuck you some more. Is the capital of Concord ship probably has a lot of gold on board. And we're coming back. Yeah, I think I need to put a, uh, a deposit down on this, though. Well, he will pull it off the shelf. It's on this, like, little mannequin head. And he spins it around his finger a little bit. You interested? I mean, what do you think? He gives a knowing smirk. It would be worth it. It, it would, it would. I mean, definitely don't have those funds right now. But how much do you have? Jesus, like not that much. Hold on. Uh, I've got four hundred and sixty. No, I got close to seven hundred gold. We can try and put a down payment down. See what he wants for it. Well, I, I mean, I. I see what he's got it uh, tagged at, so... Well, see what he wants for a down payment. To hold it. Because we do yeah. have to come back and give him reports on this experimental potion. This is true. Well, you know us. We're regular shoppers here at this point. Very much so. Some you, of my could call us, patrons. you could call us guinea pigs now. Assistance. This, this I am very confident in what it does. But 300 gold, and I will hold it for put it this way 100 gold per month that I'm holding it, and that will be taken off the final price as well. No chance of uh, doing a lease purchase on this, is there? Well, I'm confident in you coming back. I have done some lease purchases before to where the purchaser has ended up no longer on this plane. I'm pound interest to call planes is a bitch. <laughs> yes. And he didn't necessarily mean like going to the Feywild, he meant like death. Yeah. Alright. Here's your 300 gold. And he'll put it, it will be in my personal box for three months. You so Also, the little girl that comes in here all the time. Here's nine platinum. And anytime she comes in to get something, you give her something. He just slides your money box. back across the table. I already give her things on the house all the time. She's one of my favorite. No, no, no. Customers. You're giving her something from us. Oh, so Gifts that we have left for her. So this is, uh... Use this money to make little magical trinkets and give them to her. There you go. He'll nod and take the money back. Heal. We're fucking soft for hardened adventurers, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Damn right we are. And we're proud of it. We're soft for one person, okay? So you're hard for everyone else, Trey? You will, you will mercilessly kill people that look at you wrong, but God forbid Chris, somebody touches how do you feel about Trey girl. being hard for everyone else? We will torment... Uh, an innocent, relatively innocent noble band for a month on end. Come on, that just was because really, that was just very funny. So. That was very funny. Well, uh, was there anything excess or was there anything y'all needed? I know you're a little low on funds, but no, there wasn't anything uh, that I wanted either. So, soul. Oh wait, hold on. There was some. There was some. Y'all are pretty right. soft on mistress too. To be clear. That's okay, fair. that's fair. Sure. So, sure. was there anything you needed? Uh, no, I'm good. Well, will you guys pay for me? Because I have no money. Yeah, that's what I'm asking. There's oh, you okay. Like, within reason. I can't buy uh, you. I need the one greater healing and uh, There's, two yeah. of the regular healing. 
Okay. Oh. There's a bunch of cool things. Uh, the pair of path of spells, so entering rings of care of glass thing is not necessarily necessary. Uh, Those are literally the two items I can't buy you. <laughs> uh, oh, I'm just saying the rings of care of casting will not be good because usually a spell save in an area effect where it would matter if someone saves uh, will do like half damage, which oh could be cool for all of them. So I could like. For sure, that would be cool. What is it? But no, uh, the rings of careful casting. Like, if I were to give you one and me one, then you definitely have evasion for when I cast the area of effect dexterity save. I mean, yes, but we're talking about a whole lot of money. Yeah, it's not worth it. I believe in you. Um, so is there now... anything more uncommon that you might have your eye on? <laughs> um. <laughs> I'd say the pair path of spells catering is pretty it's, uncommon. It's like um, when you take a girl out on a date <laughs> and she's like ordering oh, the you're most paying? expensive <laughs> thing. Okay. Can we not Can we make a steak and with lobster? Like yeah, are you saying they have surf and turf? Or surf they and surf and surf and turf? They have surf and turf and turf and turf with caviar. I normally have to wait until at least the second day to order the caviar I'd with like to like make somewhere. Alaska's for the road. Um... <laughs> No one even likes I'll, steak Alaska. Get out of here. I'll just eat it. I know. It's a perfect rich person. I'll food. throw it away like it. right away. Um, uh, you buy it just to buy a steak. Oh, you are taking the ring into loneliness, Chris? Sorry, I just saw that. Yes. Whoa, just to add to my cooking wild. repertoire. Help you with that after meals. Clean up. Yeah. Um, all good. Like, what does the Boots of Sound Mind do? Unless you, you guys think. Okay, so, Boots of Sound Mind are actually... No, so if you are ever charmed or frightened, your speed, speed is reduced to zero. Oh, so you can't go away or come towards... So you can't be made to but... f run from a creature if you're feared I by it. I see what you're saying. So it's one of those that's like, it's we weirded wordly, and it kind of seems stupid, but at the same point it's in time... weirded wordly. It, it makes sense now. In certain aspects, it would be really useful. Unless you get that particular frightened that all you can do is run away. No, because then your speed is zero. So, I mean, yeah, I mean, that No, way. but, like, you have to... Your only action can be dash. And yeah. if you can't dash, then your action is to uh, dodge. Dodge. Yeah, I mean, it lets you dodge, at least. So, mm -hmm. that's... Barbarian tank with dodge game, action, right? yeah. I mean... Right? Can't hit me now. Uh, I will buy the trusty tankard, and, uh... He has multiple trusty tankards, by the way. Like, that, I just didn't put that in. Uh, that's fine. I'm um, gonna buy one. Those. We're gonna be on a ship and you don't want your ale to spill? Listen, you stay on a ship for, like, 30 years. You learn to appreciate Okay, it. 30 years Val's later. Val's not <laughs> even that old. He's not. Yeah, <laughs> You said he was like oh, 21, he's 22. Like 20, when you're buying he's like 22 it, years old. he does slide across the table. One of my most yeah. useful inventions as of such. and uh, Right? It's so handy. I, every sailor that so comes handy. through, I had a captain buy one for all of his people. Yeah. He Actually, said, do you have a discount for uh, multiple buys? Uh, so, Oladim, <laughs> you're buying the potions. You're buying that. So, roll a charisma check. I'd like to get two for the price of one. Probably won't give you that much, but... Oh. Potion of growth. Oh, um, oh Wasting so... all of my rolls before we get into combat. Okay, uh, I, I have know. to go, guys. What? What? Something Everything alright? Just posted about it and chat about it. Okay. I will see you guys on Tuesday or Saturday, depending. Okay. Uh, things good. see. It's alright. Have fun, man. Okay, well, we can Jaeger him. Um, Oladim, your price is brought down to 225 and he'll sell them to you for 80. Uh, two for 80? Yes. Okay. So what, I just got 25 gold back? Yeah. Because you're buying a lot, he's giving you a little bit of a gotcha. bulk by discount. Alright, there were a couple of persons I want to get to. Um, 
fucking break into that. Also, Mistress, how much money are you spending on supplies? Food? Um, so I have 149 gold left. So all of it? So all of it. You're muted. You are. I have 149 gold left. <laughs> so all of it. Okay, that will give you... Uh, let's look at your cookbook. I mean, recipes like... are pretty much one to two gold, so, like, say... Yeah. How much? How many days worth of food are you trying to buy? Um... Okay, hold on. We'll just say a gold per food. We're, because... we're sailing from Nigadonna's to Port de Molly. It's 15 days if there is no trouble. You need to make sure that you enunciate Nicodronus. Nicodronus. Oh. Uh, so Ooh. It's 15 <laughs> days. You heard that getting, too? Yeah, yeah, I did. Oh, I did. You're getting boy. real close to getting canceled there. Oh boy, <laughs> I thought it was going to be me. Oh. <laughs> okay. Um, that was close. <laughs> we're about to have a crossing the bridge moment. We don't need that. I will real ugh. gamers. <laughs> Hopefully, pick up gamers. food on the way there. So you're not stopping in another city because you're not going. No, to I mean like hunting. Oh yeah, you have about hunting all, or fishing. You have like five yeah, days in the woods. You do have that fishing rod that I got you. Yeah, and he's a bear. Bear like fish. So right. Um. So. Ten days of people food and ten days of barefoot food. Call that like twenty-five gold. Oh, well then fifteen. Uh, of each. I'll... Thirty-eight oh, okay. gold. You're, you're going to. Okay. So. I thought she was trying to lower the price. No, I shouldn't. Ex realize no, because like that. I'm looking like a lot of them are one or two gold for your normal meals, but then there's all your homemade meals which are cheaper. Right. So. It, I pretty much was putting it at one, just over one gold a day. Yeah. You know, two. Okay. And then the bear food is like. And then I still have three servings of Kraken, which does water breathing? Um, yes. You gain. That oh, no, no. It's, spell. uh, you gain a swimming speed and the ability to oh, dive swimming. to extreme depths for 24 hours without any hmm. of the. Oh, and breathing. How many days does it. Take to sail at least from two. Nico Dronis. You Thank are you. on <laughs> the ship for from Cat Girl Land. I wrote from Cat Nico <laughs> from Cat Girl City. Uh, yeah, is... Can we go to the capital of Cat Girl, please? Can we get a Neko Parhadronis? I believe it is nine days of ocean travel and five days or six days of uh land travel. Okay. If we go to Necodronus, I would like to meet the Necomancer. The Necomancer? <laughs> oh, the Necomancer! Please. Oh my gosh. Hey, Trey, can you make a Charisma saving throw for me? What? Charisma no, it's yeah, happening. It's happening. Hey, hey, Trey, are you gonna go necking with the Necomancer? Charisma saving. It's heckin' I hate you. Do, kids oh. do, do the kids even know what necking is anymore? Do the yeah, it's, it's where you rub your Adam's apples together. It's where you rub your Adam's apples together. Thank you. <laughs> I, I was like, wow. As the only, as the only certified young person left in the. Uh, chat. He is a certified young man. I, I'm a certified young man. Um. By the yeah. way, I love that great poster so answer. much. It's, it's, it's so, so great, great, isn't it? I need that poster on my wall. <gasps> That's so cool. Anywho. <laughs> Can you show that on stream, Jake? That needs yeah. to be seen. I love it I, I so much. I don't know who the original Holy, artist is. That though. is so big. You can just image search it. Yeah, but that can Reverse just search as well. it. Is, uh, we're sorry for the distraction, but this is what we're distracted about, and it's amazing. We're sorry. It is. It is a fantastic okay. poster. Finish up with. I'm gonna Don't it. Go free from my water. Decide what you're what? buying, and I'll be right back. Okay, while well, DM's gone, we're just stealing everything from the shop. We're coming right, to guys. We're gonna put and we're fleeing. No, I've never been come back ever again. Only half paying attention for the past hour. What are we doing? All of them. I need you to run, get Lily. Don't tell her why, but take her. We're gonna kill everyone here. And we're never well, coming back. 
my gosh. It's on Discord. Oh, that black oh, coffee. Everyone post here out. in general. I might buy that. Chris, did you see the Sailor Meow one? Necromancer poster print. That's do you, very cool. Oh, do you remember that one that's like a uh, kitty making biscuits? Yeah. <laughs> I might be buying some of these. I'm not really even a cat person, but I might be buying some of these. Wow, I'm look a cat at that person guy. buy them for me. Yeah, the black coffee one is Ooh, fantastic. Ooh, black coffee is very good. Isn't it? A wild cat Thulu appears. The terrible unicorn cat. <gasps> I just saw the sailor meow. Yeah. Ah! It's Wait, so is that in you, Yasha? Ooh. A wild cat one? Anime no, no, no. Dude, it's so it's damn the delicious. Cat captor Sakura? Yeah. I thought it was something from Inuyasha. It's not. Oh, the Sailor Meow, though. It's an different anime. My friend likes it very much. Card Captor Sakura. Um, bow. Look at this one. Anime food. Okay. It's so what damn buying, delicious. Though? I bought a potion of greater mana. Really? Hey, guys. My birthday For is you? in, like, uh, three yeah. months. Our anniversary is in, like, a month. Wow. But my birthday's in like <laughs> wow. three months. Ooh, okay. Chris, look up two posts. You uh, really stared in his face and said, Who cares? My birthday is in three months. Really no, look at that. It's man only home. eleven years of marriage. No big deal. You no really biggie. Look at all these I love this. Say, 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 enough. Um, wheat snuff. Set wheat snuff. Set wheat. I'm dead right, now. Back to D &D. Uh, I bought a person of greater mana. Okay. And that was it. <laughs> the role Say I was love. born to play. Alright, let's play Dungeon <laughs> Dragon. I was gonna get the Hill Giant strings too, but like an extra three strength is not all that great. Well, the, an extra second level spell slot isn't necessarily great either. For yeah, but it's more worth it for you than it is for. Uh, plus one damage for me is not as good as another spell slot is for you. I guess. Especially if you get when you put it like that, or or if it was for like Ben. Either I mean, because he doesn't have as much guys uh, spell slots in general. He so I bought spell slots. Nice. So I bought two potions of greater mana. Ska spell slots. Pick it okay. up. Pick it up. Uh, so that'd be 300, knock it down to 275, because I'm just carrying that discount over. Alright. Guys. I have too many tabs open. I'll have and I'm um, down to 35 gold now. So you're all broke, besides, you're all broke. Yeah, no, I we're, figured... we're all broke now. I don't have any extra I don't stuff have. in the back. We're not going to be shopping for a while. It's okay. Well, I mean, I, okay, so I still have 137 gold. I'm not... I you know how many opportunities we'll have to make money in the Feywild. Don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> you know how many shops we're gonna find in the Feywild? You know how many fuck, business fuck, opportunities fuck, in the Feywild? Like, wait, 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 wait. This is the last time before the Fey, right? Yeah. Yeah. Do you remember one of my rules, Jake? I do. I don't even know how I had. Never go to the Feywild. <laughs> I don't even remember if it was one of my rules. I don't know Hold which on. rule you're talking about. You sent me like 10. <laughs> <laughs> remember all of my rules, Jake. <laughs> yeah, remember all of them. Remember okay, all wow. of them. Remember all of them. Listen, when you die a permadeath, that's going to be our battle cry. Remember all of them. All of who? All of who? All of them. <laughs> no, all of them offenses you made against us. All of the things, all of the people, all of the places. Uh, yeah, you, did, you didn't say that one to me. <laughs> it was just headcanon. But yeah, as we walk out, I will toss you one of the two potions. So, head cannon. Are we making it cannon? And dang, would I? The word head cannon so just I makes me think of like no. a girl that has like a insanely head. aggressive head skills. That's a cannon head 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 head. part. So, oh, 
Oh, I'm thinking way more fantastical. You're thinking. And is it <laughs> gold specifically or is it coins? <laughs> Bro, gold she blew up my dick! <laughs> She's a fucking head cannon! She's That's a up to you if you want to tell them. It's, it's your choice. Y'all need to get your heads out of the gutter. Head cannon reminds me of Blast. Whether I tell them or not, is it going to be Dude, canon part of the world? I... <laughs> that man gives sloppy toppy. I mean, that... oh. it's up to whatever mistress believes about her tribe. Because that's where you're the kind of authority. <laughs> the tribe? Okay. Like, because, okay. I mean, the, it's a broad subject. There are going to be definitely, like, elven cities that still trade in it because, you know, they think they're above everything else. But. You know your forest better than anyone. <sighs> well, now, now that I'm playing through Pokemon Let's Go Eevee, I'm going to have to change Blastoise's name to. Uh, the Headcanon. No, the faucet failure, because that boy Fossil got drift. failure, because that boy got drift. <laughs> yeah, that's, yeah. I got faucet failure, but I got drift. <laughs> oh, I are. almost, I almost, Stop. I'm so sorry. Stop it. Stop no, it. Jake, I don't care. As you walk me. out, I give one of the two potions of greater mana to Soul. I don't toss it to him, because I'm afraid of him dropping it. Ah! <laughs> you, you, <laughs> you hand it to me gently. I'm like, whoa! <laughs> I go crack it over his head like a runny egg. No! <laughs> Soak up a magic, magic boy. <laughs> I permanently and, uh, get one extra second level spell slot. Yeah, I was about to say, if he mainlines that. If I main, if I inject that straight into my bloodstream, you already know what the fuck up. Listen, on. take it annually, it'll get in faster. Boof. Dude, it's hold on. Can you, can you boof a health potion and it be a stronger effect? You oh. haven't tried yet. Let's do All it, them? guys. All of them? Next time things go real south, I'm boofing one, okay? Okay. Okay. I'm writing this down the next time you're unconscious. <laughs> <laughs> Comes to consciousness, Val's rough hands caressing his body. <laughs> Don't worry. You, you gave pre-consent. Oh my gosh. Just bent that, over one of his knees. That the was problem with sticking a bottle inside of any orifice is that it creates a vacuum whenever you go to pull it back out. <gasps> Try so, it. Uh, okay, we're not, we're not getting it. into the specifics of this. Why you cracked glass? Anyway, moving on. I give the you, other one. Oh. I give the other one to Exa. Okay, so Exa has that. Thank you so much. I'm Exa. Is there anything else you'd like to do? And who wants Get to Jaeger Exa? Get on a boat, baby. Who wants to Jaeger the other the... spellcaster? Yeah, I was supposed to say, we got the spellcaster oh, yeah, spell I don't have access to his character sheet. Oh, I I'm also about to don't give have access it. to the character sheet. I mean, it's I'll... on roll 20 and not D&D Beyond, so... Let's let the yeah. spellcaster do the spellcaster stuff. Okay. I'm not even going to try. Fair, you have two spellcasters yeah. now. Think ahead on your turns. All right. Well, <laughs> I, I was also, like, referencing wow. Chris as a spellcaster, but... Oh, yeah, Chris. I mean... I was just saying, like, I'm not going to I was outspoken about it. Would you like to? What? Would you like to Jaeger Ben? Do you want to play an artificer? Yeah. Yeah. Or, yeah. Do you want to play an artificer? It's I've like a never... wizard, but worse. Uh, no. <laughs> no. Okay, so... <laughs> Slowly speaking, an artificer? <laughs> so what? You gotta oh, Those fuck. scared me. <laughs> It's yeah, like a I'll wizard, play. but in a different language. And wizards already intimidate. I played me. it like three weeks ago. I'll be fine. Yeah, it's, it's like playing a wizard, but yeah, in but Spanish. Yeah, but it's like a level five. But yeah. in Spanish, artificial. I need you to make the same voice, though. We can build it. Yes, we can. <laughs> the same okay. voice I had for my other artificer. Yeah. Okay. Wizards are just all the builders who grew up. As you guys hey, get guys, to the docks. Hey, guys. As all you right, get to sorry. the docks. There is a slightly familiar face that you haven't seen in multiple years approaches you, Val. You can't place a name, uh, but you remember him as one of the past betweens. He's a captain, a uh, short dwarven man, and he just, uh, I believe I'm ferrying you all to uh, your next ship. That would be correct. Hmm. Follow me. And he will lead you aboard. It is a very small ship, uh, something that just does like fishing day trips. Not actual large voyages. Uh, within 20 minutes, you guys are off, and about 30 minutes of sailing, you guys do find another ship that's just kind of floating in harbor that has recognizable sails and recognizable ship overall as 
the ladder is dropped and you climb up to the deck. Before we climb up, I turn to him and I say, thank you for the trip, fairy man, and I give him two gold. He takes them and nods his hat to you and just starts setting up his fishing rods to start doing his daily fishing. I kind of look at everyone pointedly to say, give the fairy man two gold. You say like I have two gold, man. I reluctantly give him two gold. I'll pay two for you, so but you gotta pay the fairy man. Thank you. Pay the fairy man, like in that myth. Mistress will hand over two gold, but she's very confused about this this custom. He smiles and puts it all in like a little uh, pouch and aside, just taps it once you all give him the gold and gives you a nod. As you all climb up the ladder, That's you sick. see a familiar leather clad, nice little pirate trifold hat on. Smiling at you, the it's snow. A tricorn. It's a yeah, full tricorn. trifle hat. It's tricorn. whatever. I don't know. The it's a tricorn. Oh, tricorn. Thank you. It's a giant uh, tricorn hat. The snow leopard pattern tabaxi of three earrings, looking at you with a wide smile. Uh, I hear that we are in business together for a short while. Yes. Sir. And- we even brought you a gift for your services. I'll pull out the tanker and hand it to her. And she looks and goes, Is this one of those ones that that shop is selling that doesn't spill? It yeah. Is. Wait, can, have you tested it yet? Can you turn it upside down? I put, like, water in it and turn it upside down. Uh, so as you turn it upside down, it seems like there is a invisible... It looks like almost like saran wrap, but there's nothing there. Just an invisible line that it all stops at. Oh my gosh. I like, I drink it like a gerbil. <laughs> she just, did, you just, did you just take her mug? No, yours. <laughs> Do you have one out? I'll I, take yours. Technically, yeah. I want to pull them both out. Soul just appears next to you and like, it's still in your hand, like pours water into it and then like turns your hand over so you're still holding it and like starts <laughs> dr- drinking Licking it. And the <laughs> just looks at you in size and goes, I can do that in, in the animated version of this. is going to come out in five years. <laughs> <laughs> I can see I Zol just appear. <laughs> how, is, yep, how, I, is, how are we supposed to chug that? I don't understand. Oh, I mean... And she'll take out a little flask and pour it in it, and she just drinks it normally. <laughs> Isn't it just easier to drink from the flask? No, but these don't spill. If you have it open and you hit a wave and it tips over, it doesn't, it doesn't spill. Ah. Maybe I'm just too much of a... I don't know. Landlubber? Yes. Oh! Fucking got your ass! I'm just gonna go sit underneath the stairs over here. And she chuckles, and the crew is much the same. There is, uh, like, two new people that are nondescript. Uh, I'm very glad to see you guys haven't changed much since I've seen you last. You've got two new red shirts. <laughs> I don't understand that reference, but if you mean they're going to die, probably. That's how this business goes. <laughs> Red coats? Um, not red, red shirts. And yeah, she'll give a whistle, back. and I'm not going to do that because that'd be army. mean. And your hand, and you see the sails unfurl, and the boat catches. We have time to make. <gasps> Let's go! So, Onward! The first day is nothing's going to happen because you aren't really starting the sail until like two. So it's just a nice, and you're still within like Concord limits. But is there anything anybody wants to do on the ship for the first day? Man, I wish I had the Cook. anime object spell. That would be so fi. Uh, you do remember from your first ship here that Three Earrings does not have an actual cook on board. <gasps> so any oh. cooking you can do will be out of your own pocket and stuff, but much appreciated by the crew. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm good. Sphinx. <laughs> Sphinx oh, and Shield? Sphinx. Yeah. Uh, good. Gerbil. Gerbil. <laughs> J.R. Bull. <laughs> um, so what are you making do I... for dinner, Mistress? Hell. Um, anybody I, else? I don't know. Anybody Make else want to do anything, or are we just going to have JR or Trey is the first roll for the next day? Huh? It's not going to be Ben. 
No. Ben, do it. Uh... Wait, it's... Ben never left. He rolls really quick. <laughs> he just pranked us. Five. Yeah, it's Was four. it a d20 that you wanted us to roll? Uh, Is it just... a d20? Yes, it's just a d20. Uh... Okay. Roll a five. Oh, I, I can't ghost roll us in either. Doesn't give me permission to do that. <laughs> Soups. Minstrum soup. Maker rolls. Oh, I do want to do something. She a good mind strong. Ow! <laughs> uh, you make. <laughs> You pull out one of your bigger pots and you make a fantastic soup that the crew loves. Let me update experience and then. Mindstone. Mindstone. Uh, sleep is Thank easy you. the next Thank night. Uh, before we go to sleep, I would go find uh, three earrings and just let her know hey, like. You know so-and-so, Captain Lamuth. He's probably gonna come kill us. Be prepared! Ship battle! Woohoo! Roderick has informed me of this unfortunate proposition, and my ship and crew are not well manned for this. We are much more uh, hit and run, but... Been if, thinking about that. If it does come to battles... My crew will be set to keeping the ship fine, and I will do my best to uh, join you on the endeavor. I don't know which ship he mans, um, but if um, we are quicker than him, we can harry him. Or uh, we are, escape from more suitable advantages ground. We are a uh, fair bit quicker, but not enough to escape if they come head on. They can much more durable than us, and they can just ram us and... Well, not many good things happen after that. That's what I was afraid of. It's as long as you're aware. Oh, I am sadly aware, but... We'll do our best to protect this ship. That bastard has killed a few of my friends as well. So if blood is to be spilled, then let blood be spilled. Not making a suicide run, but... Yeah. I wouldn't mind spilling some blood. He gives you a smile. We all die at some point. Make it a good death. Uh, she has taken us to, um, I'm putting not Broken up. Bank. Nope. She's taking you directly what? there. Oh, wrong. Oh, is she? Okay. Yeah, that's what, uh, this will cost you, by the way, this, the cost of this is 60 gold. Right. The cost of the chip? The cost of the, the voyage. The trip, because she's going to take us to Biss Off Isle for free, but then we would have to pay. Yeah. To but... go north. So... She's taking you here, the mouth of the riverbank is what she was told. Unless somebody changes their mind along the way, but yes. Anywhere. I'll jump here. into the ocean. <laughs> right? I'll swim I'll from here. Thing. Yeah. I mean between all Get of you should be able to scrounge up sixty gold. Yeah, I mean I got thirty gold. I'll pay for it. The whole thing? Yeah. Okay. okay. Whoa! Big ballin'. I'm not gonna say no to that. That was Exa. That's why I wasn't doing it. <laughs> <laughs> Do... Does she get paid now? Uh, she's not, she's not asking for the gold. Something. No, no, you're paying. You're giving her the money. Oh. Mainly, she's fine to do it, but it's giving her crew something so they're not missing out on ten days worth of doing something. Okay, I'll give it I'll to her now. Pull your side and explain like. It's going to be 60 gold for the trip. Um, it would be free to piss after, but after that, it's a bit of a detour for them. There's nothing up there. So we do have to make up costs for the crew. They're not going to get paid. Like, she's not going to distribute money to them right now. They have nothing to spend it on. But As long as know. the payment is given by the time you land, yeah. you're fine. Before we arrive, 60 gold. Um, and... Can I not just give it to her now? You could, if you want to. I'm just letting you know this is the price. And I'll split it, if you'd like. No, that's fine. <laughs> All right. So, as the next day progresses, around 10am, you all hear screaming on deck. 
not necessarily like horror screaming, but call to attention. And as you all approach the top deck to investigate what's going on, you do see probably around a 90 foot long swirling silver dragon. Not the large bulky dragons are used to a very small slender one without any wings that just seems to be floating through the air has surrounded the ship and is eyeing the captain curiously and, and it's a what dragon silver oh and it seems to have its head at the back of the ship and three earrings seems to be in hushed tones with it can i eat a serving of my dragon turkey you can. Oh, okay. Thought you were about to offer dragon jerky to the dragon. No, I'll that eat was it. Like... Uh, and ah. I'll just like I'll just hand it out to anyone who wants a piece. So, do I hear what they're saying? Reminding anybody? Yes, in hushed tones, you do hear three earrings in draconic saying. Just very casually, like a very... Her body posture is very, like, innocent and, like, non-threatening. I swear we are just going about our business. I'm faring these men to their to these people to their destination. We have no ill will towards you. Um, everything here is fine. We are not up to anything nefarious. And the dragon in her gruff voice, go, like, looks back and goes, Do not lie to me, little one. And tell if you are. Are you carrying anything on board that would be, let's say, not viable for my people? And three Aaron just looks back and goes, "No, we have uh, no quarrels with you or your people. Um, we are just doing our stuff. I understand why you're investigating, but." There's nothing. Uh, if you're looking closer at the dragon now, you do see that it's mane of hair that's around its face and down its back. And instead of where normal dragons have spikes, this has a small mane of hair. Uh, it's like this rainbow, like almost like that uh, oil <laughs> spill, like constantly changing dark gray on its silver scales. Oh, uh, that's a whole... It's a silver dragon? Yes. But okay. not like your typical silver dragon. This one looks long and slender without wings. And it... Does it look marine-ish? No. Uh, it okay. doesn't seem to be... If you look over the edge, it's not touching the water at all. It is actually, like, perched on the back of the ship, and its body is wrapped around the ship. Okay. So this, and, is, this is, like, the dragon from uh, Never Ending Story? Yes. Sort of like an East Asian-ish. Falcor. Yeah, East Asian, East Asian does, dragon. Good does it Falcor. seem like she's got it under control? Or I, is he... Neither of them seem aggressive, and you do see its uh, face shift to the left to where its its face, its head, is probably about twice the size, if not more, than Three Earrings' body. And so, adult? Older? Bigger than any dragon you've ever seen. Oh. Um, bigger than Glitz? Probably around the... Uh, longer than Glitz, probably around the same size as Glitz, if you had to guess. Uh, and its eyes shift, and you just see this stark, like this sapphire blue eye peer into, like peer at three earrings, and it blinks, and it just releases itself from the ship and goes, I trust you for now. Not turn in the future. And it just spirals upwards into the air and flies off. And three earrings, like, as she turns around, if... Tabaxi's could become pale, she would be, but she just recovers her composition and makes a quick gesture to the crew to get back to work and continue flying and goes back to hurt the wheel. I'll approach her and just kind of casually lean on the railing next to her, munching on the jerky and say, well, I knew you were good with tongues, earrings, but that's a new trick. And she just exhales. Oh, don't get me started. There's been a slight disruption in some people's pockets and there. The revelry has upset a group of dragons that we've done some business with. 
And so they're looking for the treasure that was lost at sea because they don't believe that the ship went down. But... And she just, like, she'll stop talking at that and just look away. I just kind of glance back towards Mistress and everybody else who's watching, like, what the fuck do we do with this? I'm just gonna shrug my shoulders, looking at you. Don't worry about it, it probably won't concern you much, it's just... Do you know how many times I've heard it probably won't concern you much in the past two or three months? Probably quite a lot. And do you know how many times it has wound up concerning us? Probably quite a lot. Is there anything we should know? It will be smoothed over eventually. This was just a wrong time, wrong place thing. Best thing if you run into these is don't lie. He wasn't kidding. If you lie to them, they can tell. We have nothing to lie about. We don't know anything about the situation. Well, that's Perhaps it's safe. It's best that it stays that way. I don't she nods. Agreed. Runs in him. But the rest of the day, the mood on the ship is definitely more of a little bit of fear. But you don't sight the dragon again, and it continues on its way. Or the ship continues on its way. Uh, Mr. if you want to just make a roll for your food today. And so, yep. you're up next for hey. 20. Okay! Uh... Believe you. Also, how many people ate the dragon jerky? Uh... I feel like I was handed one. Hey, baby, what's your love? My way, I can be your own. <sighs> Best one, baby. Five percent chance. Give me a second. Uh, mistress, your food is uh. Not the best today, but not horrible, especially for that on the road or on the sea. Where is this? There it is. I don't like how he said 5% chance. Shouldn't. Yeah. Really shouldn't. <sighs> we'll be fine. Um. You are all awoken early in the morning by the clap of thunder. As you look out, the sea around you is probably one of the worst storms you've ever braved on the ocean. Yeah, that's a good question. Val included? Uh, yes. Val included. I was muted, yeah. so they didn't hear me. Val included. I was muted. <gasps> Pars. Val included. This is one of the worst storms you have ever seen. Huh. I didn't expect this, so give me one moment. Uh... You guys want to put yourselves on the smaller ship? Just as I describe the scene. And you'll have time to do stuff, but I'm just happy to do something real quick, so I want to, to make uh, best, best of time. So the, the smaller, smaller ship? The smaller ship. Alright, so I'm somewhere around the stairs underneath it. Boop, 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 boop. Uh, again, this is not immediately in the beginning of the day. The, you wake up at about 6am to this horrible storm. Oh, we woke up to it? Yes, it, it clap, you can go back to bed if you want, but the clap of thunder wakes oh. all of you. The ship is rocking horribly. And three earrings will come down and tell you, I will stay bunkered down for now if you want, but uh, this weather is not natural. It's, it's, nope. uh... Believe it or not, I'm fairly nimble. If there's anything you need topside, I'll come up there and help. If you would uh, like to get up to the top of the mast... Uh, and keep a lookout around us, any massive waves coming, and just shout them to us. Alright, uh, I'm going to very rapidly get up there. 
I'll be uh, up on deck too. Uh, your help is much appreciated. Um. Uh, Val. When do I get control weather? <laughs> That's like an 8th level spell. Right now. Yeah, I know. Clap of the thou- wow. The clap of the clouds dummy thick cheeks. Ooh, oh, it is an 8th level spell. Yeah. <sighs> That'll be helpful later. No, it won't. <laughs> I'm just um, kidding. All of them. Around 2 in the afternoon. You... See another ship in the storm. Whoa! Is that on the sea? It is. is it slightly bigger than us? Yes. It... Is it green? Does it have five bandits on it? Um. Oh, give me a second. Again. Is it the Jolly Roger? Yes. Is yeah, it the Jolly Roger. Roger? No, it's a ghost ship. Is it the Black Pearl? They have stats for a ghost ship and. Go um, so don't make play a, with me. Make a quick history check for me, Aladdin. Just basic quick intelligence history. history. I, I don't have quick history under here. <laughs> make, a a quick history. History. make a quick no. history. Make a meditative Make a elongated history check. Draw it out, baby. History check. Make a cute history check. <laughs> I get, I get history check. <laughs> make an obtuse. Make a cute little history check, baby girl. Pinch his cheek. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh, souls on the bottom of the ship vomiting profusely. Oh my god. Um, I will be for the rest of this. He's actually gone hoarse from vomiting so hard and he can't do anything somatic. Oh but no. Horse not somatic. my horse <laughs> somatic. My fingers. Because no, you're just wrenching so hard, you can't do anything. Oh else. no! Why is that on you, Teen Vogue? The batteries died. On TeenVogue.com, okay. there's an the article have another that one says, for you, "Okay, okay." Is Harper awake? She, yeah, she is still awake. At nine thirty-nine, Harper. Harper. Yes. She's been up, like, every three minutes for the last hour and 40 minutes. Every three minutes? Um, it's so... Just no Aladdin, you... don't recognize the colors of the ship. But can I see the colors and shout them down? Or use the coin? Uh, when it gets closer, you can. You're only it's it's still far enough away that the you're only seeing colors when well, the lightning I'm strikes. Least, I'm at least going to message that there's a ship. On yes. The, uh, so the rest of you do know there's a ship, probably about a quarter mile off. Oh, rain is coming down in heavy, heavy sheets. Um, and the rest of the crew, are you relaying the messages to three earrings, Val? Yeah. Um, do we know what the I'm assuming. Is? Sorry, go ahead. No. Uh, I was assuming that was three earrings manning the. Uh, steering the ship. Yes, that is three earrings. I just don't have a specific token made for her yet because I forgot. Yeah. I have completely blanked out on all nautical terms. I've completely blanked um, out on all terms. What is, what is the. Helm? Yes. Oh. Okay, away is the ship. <laughs> uh, can I give you some sort of check to figure that out? Yes, make a nature Starboard. survival or just intelligence. Do I need to make a check to uh, teleport? Cannot... No, once he tells you, it's fine. Okay. Survival 12, uh, you guess somewhere between uh, give or take a quarter mile away. Yeah, so, like... Uh, I, I could tell you if we were on land, I, I don't know how far away the horizon is on the ocean, sorry. Yeah. Especially <laughs> with... Well, no, you can't see the horizon. Like, the fact that you can see this ship that far out is... You know I mean? yeah. I, I'm, I'm guessing quarter mile on this. Yeah. Probably the total of your vision this far up with the sheets of rain downpouring. And you're only seeing it when lightning strikes. That's the only thing telling you that, like, 
oh yeah, that is definitely a mask and colorful sails and not just another wave. I'll relay the message. Maybe a quarter mile, Captain, but it's hard to tell. <sighs> Hopefully this isn't bullshit. In this storm, it's probably bullshit. Who else would be out in this? I don't... Fuck off. Feeling alive. Are, are you keeping the coin open for that conversation, Val? Yeah. We're out in this. <laughs> exactly. And what are we on? Bullshit. I'm always on my bullshit. Hey, yeah, yo! I dap you up. <laughs> All the way up here on top of the... In the, in the she she somehow, <laughs> I float up, up there. You're puking violently into the crow's nest. squish up the mast. No, I'm not be a lizard. Uh, I am, however, going to anchor myself up here. Uh, there Kick. is some um, rope along the top of the crow's nest that you can wrap your arms around, so that way you're not. And I'm guessing you probably have had one arm wrapped around this just because of how violent and rocking the sea is. Yeah, yeah. I just, I, I want to make it clear now that I am anchoring myself up here. Okay. It, no, it, think not, about not it. in a way that I'm, like, tying myself and won't be able to untie, but basically winding it around myself. Yeah. Think about it, earrings. Who else would be out in this storm? We're not on any particular... We're not good people. We're revelry. Only we would be stupid enough to come out in the storm. Who else would be stupid enough to come out in a storm like this? One quarter does. safe in their harbors. People Who else has a trouble. mission? She looks at you knowing. She goes, I know. God damn it. Yeah, I'm the captain, it's your choice. Ready. If you think we can fight in the storm, but... She's gonna grab the... Can, will you let her grab the coin from you? Yeah. She grabs the coin and concentrates for a second. Everybody but Val, or I guess you're standing next to her, you hear. Does it look like they're making a headline for us? Make a perception check. What's what you mean, me? Yes. God, these rolls are bad tonight. I wish you had to roll that one first. Um, yeah, right? It was well, a disadvantage because it was in the rain. You cannot. Oh. No, no, no. If that's disadvantage. Well, yeah, so, it's not one. Yeah. Yeah. Now that it's known that there's a ship, can I go to the front of the ship and try to yeah, help all of them? You guys have a yeah. balance. I, I use the coin to let everyone else know to be ready. This entire conversation is happening over the coin. It's too. It's There's too much rain, thunder, and lightning to see. Um, like to hear each other all of them from the mast, right? Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm just gonna tell her to assume that it's headed for us. I can't. Miss, just make your perception check normal okay. because of your sentinel shield. Okay. What do my special eyes see? <laughs> um, you get to the front of the map, you get to the front of the ship, and you grab the railing, and as you look out. You guys are cresting a wave about to crash, yeah, the world. and lightning strikes at the exact moment, and you do see that the ship is pointed to intercept you. And you, with that 25, notice the familiar colors that you have seen posted in so many harbors before. It is a Concord vessel. Ah, uh, but fine. So, okay. Everyone else would know it's a Concord vessel, but does Mistress know? You've seen these ships. Like, well, you would have also been on one. You, I've I don't told know. Y'all, yeah. I've told y'all basic colors. Oh, you did like, that I'm, in um, Bank, uh, Broken Bank. You, you told yeah. them. Okay. So, yeah, you would remember Val's words, even with that, that like. And you've seen them in every harbor you've ever been to. These colors are everywhere. I feel like that's one of the annoying things that Val would do every time we're in a harbor, is just pointing out. It's, it's like pointing out cars and be like, yeah, that's a 68 Chevelle. <laughs> just like ship packs. Like, yeah, that's a 28 gun. You could tell, you know, three masts. Th yeah. These colors mean this. Oh, I recognize that ship. This um, is who captains it. Let me make this a little more accurate. It's going to be so much bigger, isn't it? <gasps> 
Oh my god, it's away from us. Bye. Yeah. Poppy. Yep. That's a freaking frigate. It's a friggin' frigate, you guys. I like, oh. drag it so I can find the box to expand it. We're like a schooner, and it's a frigate. Yeah, this is a it's true a warship. So not a galleon, but not quite that big. Uh, it's so big that it won't fit on the map I have made. The other way? It, sh it should, Our but getting, to, the getting to that little thing that rotates it is... <laughs> up top, above it's, the map. It is so far above the top of the map that I've had to bring that to like the bottom. Oof. Do you relay that information Ooh. along? With <laughs> no. Mistress. There's... You're mu you're muted. Well, this is what I get for fucking role playing. What? Nothing. I just have to repeat what I said because it's fine. Cap Captain, there's a Concord on our way. That's what I figured. Okay. We're not probably going is to be able to uh, get out of this, so. Is that a bad thing? I thought. Oh. Are they the good guys? Are they the yeah. bad guys? If it was calm think? seas, we could probably outrun them, but in this, the wind is so sporadic that... Well... Do we need to be outrunning them? I yeah. I... I mean, boarding a ship in these seas... Oh, I guess I can't hear any of that. No, I mean, oh yeah, oh, she would have given you... Uh... Well, he's You would have seen on the right look of her, her on her face. I'm standing next to her, but I she, can't hear She's pulling your job now and repeating everything they're saying. Okay. And she'll hand you back your coin. And sees this rough boarding ship is not going to be easy. In fact, it's going to be very deadly. If they, if they outgun us, all they have to do is sink us. They're not going to sink us. Yeah, what are we... Aren't and she'll look you in the eyes and go, Lamuth is known to be too personal to use cannons on us. He knows we're here. If he knows we're here. He knows, he knows we're here. here. It's announce our presence, then. Who knows we're here? What what's happening? He doesn't he doesn't know we're here. No one knows we're here. Ooh. This is your ship earrings. I'm Are we moved. fighting? You do hear all of him saying who, by the way. I know and I'm ignoring him. No. I'm shadow Are stepping we, down there. Are we going to stand and fight? It's your ship. If we try I'm not going to endanger your crew, but I don't want to run away from the fight. We, if we try and run, he will We're not getting out of this. The storm is meant for something. <sighs> That put us in the best position to strike first. And then over the coin, I'll tell everybody this is Captain Lamuth's ship. He's coming for us. Kill me. And then he's coming for Nicodronus to kill everyone else. Okay. How high up is the crow's nest if, here? Uh, about 70 feet. If he's here... For you specifically. No, no, sorry. This is a small ship, about sixty feet, about the edge of your shadow step. Okay. I can hide you. I appreciate the thought, but I don't want to hide from him because if I hide from him, he's going to kill everyone else that's still here. Yeah, no, we're taking him out. He works for the Myriad. He doesn't work for the Concord. Does he, he know you're on this ship? He will soon. If he doesn't what? already. Let's go. If he. Does not. You have about three minutes before the ship. What if we surprise him? Range. If he doesn't know, then there's no reason for him to run us down. The storm is unnatural. Then get under deck, and he won't. He doesn't polymorph. know your allies. You're gonna yeah. polymorph on Val. If that's the plan. That's a solid plan. He could just stay on the deck unless they insist to like search for him, which would make sense because they're looking for him. So yeah, oh, yeah. polymorph would be solid. I'm not letting this opportunity go. No. If he sets foot on this deck, I'm drawing a sword and taking his head, or he's taking right mine. Now. Well, then it'd be easier if he by himself down deck looking for you, right? No, he's, he's a not prideful by himself. He's a prideful man. 
He wouldn't have to come over and fight us himself. He could just sink us and be fine with it, but he won't do no, that. He won't do that because he doesn't know that you're here. I'm sure he knows that I'm here. Ah, oh, well, you can't be certain. You don't want to count our chickens before. So we're hatching. running out of time. Okay, get below deck. I'm not oh. hiding below deck like a coward. Everyone this get man ready to killed this. my friends. He killed oh. my. He killed the people that I loved. He killed the family that I had before I had y'all. I'm oh. not cowering below deck and sneaking around and backstabbing him. Hey, okay. Set a trap for him if you'd like. He's a dangerous man, but I'm not going to cower below deck. I'll weaken right. him face. Let's set the trap. You don't have to cower below deck, but I at least want to see what he has to say. Before we, you know, launch a full-scale attack. I can make you invisible. I would not be against you shocking him with lightning as soon as he stepped foot on deck, to be honest. Alright. I don't but... particularly care what he has to say. Alright. What about I make you invisible so he doesn't, like, see you over here and is like, Oh, I'm not gonna go over there. And then shoot us. Um... I can make you invisible, he walks on deck, you get advantage to attack him your first time. Flying to rage, you do what you do best. Um, and I can shock him. What does he look like again? Don't know. Like again? You don't nobody, know? Nobody ever asked what he is. <laughs> what well, is he I didn't like? think we were gonna roll a natural one in the encounters and have to fight this guy right away. Listen, I, five percent chance. I, I didn't fully prepare for this because I was like, "What are the odds? We're gonna get like through three or four rolls tonight." Five percent, Jake. That's the odds. Yeah, five okay. I am terrified of the fight. <laughs> um, gonna be real I, with you. The odds are five percent. Um, yeah. Uh, <laughs> what does you don't know what he looks like, Val? No, I know what he looks like. Oh, what does he look I like? I don't know, what he, but I don't know what he looks like. It's not the conversation we need right now. Well, uh, we you will notice who the captain is. Uh, Val describes them in the Val DMs. Val describes him. He only know Val only knows specifically that he is a fighter and he is a Leonin. Okay, oh. that helps so much. <laughs> that truly helps. Oh. He's a lion man. He fights with ferocious meows. Let me put the <laughs> Exa 2.0 on the board, baby. Can it um, just be Exa? So is this just a reworked Exa? So place yourselves where you are. Uh, I can't move his token. You should be able to. I was able to take it out. Like, I could see it. I could take That's... it out, but I'm not oh, able to. You can whip it out, but you can't jerk it. Oh. Hey, up top. Yeah. Um, um, you have permission hmm. to move it. Can be edited. Try and delete it and then drag yeah, it. Yeah, delete out. it and redrag it. I can't delete it. No, so, so right before we drop into initiative. No. Can you move that one. Yeah. No, that's weird. I'll, I'll try to restart Re my app. Yeah, reload yeah. yours. Or you, yeah, or you may just have to um, ping it and check move it. As, yeah, that, that will work if not. Uh, when they're about within 100 feet of you, you hear about seven cannon blasts. And you see the splintering of wood outside of the side of the ship. Oh, yeah, I can't. And as you look down, you see that there is chains attached to the side of the ship. And you are being I real. Do missiles on one of those? No. They're like... <laughs> these are, these are into the, the, no, these are just... They're grappling hooks. They're cannon well, shot hooks. Like, it's still a missile. Yeah, but oh, the, like they're like jump? six foot below you into the actual <laughs> hull of the ship and not like the captain. So like they're the grab. What do you have for like one d ten plus one d ten plus wisdom or something to reduce damage? Yeah, and if you don't reduce damage full, it just these would do more damage than you could probably. <laughs> um, also, you're not right next to it. It's not aiming at you. You can hear the slight cranking as you guys are being pulled closer to them in the sea. Two things did. Three earrings not gonna send a good position to strike first, and number two, right before we drop an initiative, I'm drinking that potion. Um, yeah, same. Potion of haste. Yep. So you are holding action that the second like the gang planks go down, you're drinking the potions. Yep. Sure. Oh, I'm just that's the way it's gonna. Be. You're gonna as, take them at the last possible second. As soon as we start our initiative to where we can travel between ships, I yes. am drinking it. So once like 
people, yeah. Okay, that'll be your prepped action. Mr. Actually, Solexa, you know what? If you want a prepped action. Is My prepped action is summon Fey. It's two bonus or one action. So can you still not move them, Sol? Uh, oh, okay, never no, mind. No, I cannot. I was trying I will, to make another one. Go well ahead. Yeah, you're going to get another one anyway. No, I'll go ahead and drink my potion of fast. Um, and X is gonna use his temporary hit point thing. Okay. Uh, delete the one that you're not using. There. I can't. There's two X. Okay. Just ping where you want him. Alrighty, well. Um. When they're pretty close, I'm gonna go ahead and drink the potion of fast because it lasts for ten minutes, and then. Okay, so double movement speed. Yeah, and then the I'll potion shotgun. of haste will. I don't think it'll quadruple. Your rules. Yeah, it won't quadruple. Items. It's the same effect. It's. Yeah, but haste gives me an extra action. Yeah, but I mean, the the fast is the haste without the extra action. It's just a minor thing. That's why it's uncommon. Okay. That's so fair. Well, I won't drink it then. They are and enchanted I'll with the cast. same spell. So, hold oh. on. Exhausting speed. Does that give me an extra action or just movement? Extra action and movement. Okay. It is haste, but it I have haste. like a okay. I have like a half haste. Yeah. Potion. Okay. If you'd like haste, <laughs> I have a spell called haste. I don't want you Stay to have right. to maintain concentration. Yeah. I want not in, to. Not in this fight. Yeah, not during this. It's oh, can I hand out really quickly my three treats that I make each day? that dissolve after eight hours three minutes is up okay that's fine my treats oh, i think i found the captain my treats you did find the captain it would help i was looking at roll 20. wait no this might be the captain uh, yeah that's no, probably, I don't know. I'm probably colorblind. that i don't know it's definitely this guy on the back um lamuth is a coward <laughs> and that guy has a big beard like a leona captain oh <laughs> The ballista rolled initiative. <laughs> Classic ballista. Wow, he. Oh, wait, I gotta edit his initiative because he his initiative bonus is in D and D Beyond. Yo, I'm pretty sure we're not supposed to have this fight yet. We'll be fine. Like meta gaming pigeon here. I'll be fine. You'll be fine. We'll. Uh, be roll fine. initiative for me, by the way. There's a thing that we do mm -hmm. while playing D and D. We also die. That's also a thing that we do. While playing D&D. &D. Yeah. Love D&D. &D. 10 and a 9. You know those, like, nat 20s that I was getting? Mm -hmm. Yeah, they're and those the are 19s. Gone. Yeah. Yeah, it's really bad on me, too. So where are you summoning the Furious Spirit? Because you would be doing this when it's within range. Um. Are you summoning out in your deck or on theirs? Um, that's a good question of how far out I can do it. 90 feet. The three is for me, the two is for X, so. Uh, I will do it one. when I can guesstimate that it would be 90 feet within their deck. Okay. Notes for battle. Everything is difficult terrain. The ship is rocking. There's a storm surging overhead. Everybody is considered soaked, so fire damage is halved for everybody. But lightning damage is doubled? No. Damn it. That'd be wild. Um, but just those two things to remember. All movement is ha all speed is halved because you're moving across two ships or just on a ship in this storm. <laughs> what if you have sea legs? <laughs> uh, I oh, think there was a pair. <laughs> you have legs. not even Val has been through a storm this bad. So all of them. So we're starting initiative now. The ships bar like bang together with a loud crash, and you see the other crew slide two gangplanks down. Put things in order. I will in a second. Okay. I'm. Uh, There you go. So, free action is they're moving up. Uh, I'm going to ask Val over the coin. Do you want the captain to yourself? No. Okay. There's no honor in a fight on the seas. That's fair. Take him down and the rest will surrender, hopefully. 
So, also, if we take that ship, we're going to need all the hands we can to sail it. Uh, this is going to go towards all of him. So as the ships barge together and the gang planets are down, any held action you see, so Mistress, place your Fury Spirit where you want to, Soul, what were Exa and Soul doing? Oh, hanging out. He has seven temporary hit points and he's going to get at the edge of the place. Uh, just be in a position where he can easily get around. Yeah. That looks good. Um, and Soul isn't going to maintain concentration just yet. Okay. What happens to my good good boy? We are level seven, correct? We yes. Are. Okay. I'm just I'm making sure before we start. Yes. Oh, I'm looking at like all of my class features. I was not prepared for this. <laughs> Listen. Uh so Holodin. Oh, an eight mm -hmm. does not hit. Oh also, ranged attacks are a disadvantage. Or this out, gets better and better. Sorry, ranged attacks outside of the first range. So if you're a spellcaster, you're fine. But if you're using like a bow, and it's that second, or no, no, yeah, all ranged attacks that are not spells first. are at disadvantage. Got to clarify. My apologies. So like your first increment is disadvantage, and beyond that is also disadvantage, or beyond that doesn't. Does yeah. beyond that doesn't work. Shit. Wait, what? No, what? Any ranged attack that is not a spell is at disadvantage. Um. If it has a secondary distance, that secondary distance does not hit. No Sassad Arrow. Oh, it has an AoE, right? I always forget how this... I don't think so. Does it? I'm reading it right now because... Shimmering Green Arrow starts with... The target takes 44 immediately and 24 on the next. On a miss, the arrow splashes target acid for half as much as the initial damage with no damage at the end of its turn. So you still take six acid damage, all of them, as the green is arrow. There, is there any save from that? No. Could I uh, deflect that? No, it is. You're grabbing magic at that point. I mean, you, you grab the, the shaft of the arrow and then fling it well, back. It's not no, a it's, it's a arrow. magic. It's not a. Oh, yeah, it is not an arrow. Yes, it is magic. magic. So you just take six. Arrow. It hits the um, railing in front of you and splashes, and most of it goes away and is washed away by the storm, but some of it does stay on you. Only six. Only it's only six, six of forty-six. Uh, forty-four. But yeah, all of them. It is your turn. No, I have forty-six. Oh yeah, of oh, forty-six. Four six is my total HP. Oh, and that's all I you have. Oh no. Yeah, that's all I have. I have oh, eighty-six. Actually, before you go, all of them. So before you go, come here. <laughs> I want to do something else. It is. There's more. No, no, it's uh, three Aaron's turn. Oh, good. There's more. <laughs> right, this is not a, oh god, there's more. This is, oh good, there's more. I mean, she has Tabaxi, so she's going to use that to uh, get to this guy. Aaron <laughs> says a really big beard. Uh, well, let me hit it with this spicy new Pog Champ today. Oh. Can we submit JR Pog as a Pog? You know, I wanted to because I still have the, the file for it. Yeah. Like, are they taking are they taking submissions? I don't I don't know how they're doing this. So three earrings does. Wasn't it someone different? Wait. And yeah, she yeah. slashes twice and kills a bandit. No, like the other day, oh, yeah. like, at, right after they're, they change. Every 24 it. hours. Yep. Go all three earrings. That's crazy. She's fucking wild. All right, so I did that action as basically a bonus round, correct? The drinking potion? Yeah. That was your, like, surprise round, quote unquote. Like. Okay, yeah, so that, that was my bonus round action. So yes. now I'm actually now two actions, double movement. Which is regular movement because of halved by storm. Well, that yes. shadow stepping, so... Yes. And it is a deep storm, which means the world is your oyster. Yes. The world is, is your oyster. Shadow step inside his mouth and explode his brain. Advantage on the first attack. I think I have to be able to fit in there. <laughs> Ugh, man's big right. brain, don't worry. So... 
Let's see, I'm going to use my bonus action so I can't flurry of blows. Nope. But I can hit four times regardless, because two actions. Uh, does It'll the haste be... let you attack twice? Oh, I think it just gives you one more one attack. One extra attack, yeah. It doesn't benefit from so extra it's... attack. It's three attacks, though. Five okay, attacks. Okay, so three attacks, yeah. Three, three attacks. Yeah. Okay, and so... First one's in advantage? Because haste on a level four... Well, no, I thought extra attack... Extra attack procs whenever you take the attack action. Yes, but yeah. haste has a clause that doesn't let that because using haste on a level twenty fighter would mean like sixteen attacks per turn type thing. So it's tough. Okay. okay. Yeah, it, it just gives you one more hit. Yeah. Okay. Which is cool. But... So I am going to go ahead and burn two key points. This man's wild. The second and third strike will be stunning. Okay. This is the first one's at advantage, right? First one is at advantage because of. Oh, that's yeah, no, no, the first one and the second one, not the second and third one, because I want the advantage on it. There was no second and third strike. Gamer. Oh, why was that not the first one? I know, right? So both hits. 23, 23, 23. 23, 23. It's a fairly low con save. He has saved. Wow, holy shit, yeah. And you did this to me on purpose. Uh, yes, and then sir. the second con save. Ah, oh, ha, ha. Is that a fail? We're stunned. Yeah. yeah. He's, going to, he's going to use Indomitable. Balls. Just try and reroll that. Yep. How many times can you use that, JR? Uh, one, depending on how what level he is. If he's level, level 12, he can use it twice. What level well, do you Oh, shit. Oh, balls. my fuck. Shit can balls. he? Shit balls, fuck. Can he actually? Yes. But Jake, George look at me. <laughs> Jake, drive to my house and look at me in the eyes. So uh, Jake, turn your camera on. All three of those hours. hit. Turn your camera on and look me in the face and tell me we were not prepared for this fight. <laughs> we were not prepared for this fight. Uh, 13, oh. 26. Not a crit for the second one because you didn't have advantage no, on that one. it's just eight. So Julian doesn't feel bad about rolling a natural one. I feel very bad about the TPK that I feel like I just caused because of my story. Um, oh, yeah, just, just, have just a, a less interesting story. <laughs> right? I will make you a know, boring story next like time. A boring ass story, homie. Easy. Uh, mistress, this is one is at you. Look, we can't die now because someone else has to have a turn in their arc. I want to see Feywild. I want to see Feywild. I want the Feywild. to see you the will. Feywild. After Does this, Val, though. hard cut, full different party in the Feywild. Man, I hope nothing bad uh, happens that's 15 in another damage, unit. Mistress, unless you have something to negate that. That was a fucking high damage. No. Our mirror selves in the Feywild are pissing themselves right now. <laughs> this is our second characters in the Feywild. Uh, this bandit is nuts. going to try and move, and that's about as far as he can get, because... Uh, suck it. Yeah. Captain Lamuth is going to leave you. The day. mouth. So no. Opportunity attack. You can get do opportunity have, attack. Do you have Sentinel? I don't think he does. He do you can you have it? Can you have it now? Can you have it, please? Can someone in chat buy Sentinel? <laughs> I'll buy. I'll so buy all of them, you get your atta uh, attack of opportunity. Two of he's her. stunned. No, oh, he's oh no, you he's can try and stun on this. You can, can try you? and stun on this. Yeah. You can try and stun on this. Yeah, I'll burn it. You do hit. The con save from me. Mm -hmm. mm, yes, sir. Get rid of those indomitables. Trying to. Don't uh, have indomitable. Indomitable snowmans. I will roll the damage. Yes. Come on! At eight. Oh, that is three max damages. Let me see that health go down. Let me see that health go down. It will. Uh, yeah, I was about to see your health yeah. go down too, though. Yeah, because I couldn't rage. Mm -mm. No, uh, sorry. Bruh. Homies have had to do a crazy number of attacks. Wouldn't it be wild if he was like level 20? How far can uh, you move in a realm? Uh, fighter plus mobile. And so how far can you move in a realm? Fuck you. Uh, does he? Let me check his bonus action. Fighter. I believe I can yeah. bonus action dash because of mobile. 
35 no, feet. That's you just get what plus five. 10. He can move 45 feet? Mobile. So that's a natural feet. one. Yeah, 35. Yeah, he does cut off his own arm in that sense. His right. own head. One his second. own head. Movement. It's wounding, not vorpal. It's a right. movement with half, though, right? <laughs> it is. I'm checking his thing. Um, he he cuts off his thumb. own thumb. Now he can't hold it in that hand. <laughs> He'd have to use his he, action right. at least. So he's back here. Or action surge. Or no, sorry, he's back here. To. And he's going to hold an action. Wow, what a man. That, it's for somebody to come within melee, and that roll will stay. So whatever happens, he is one attack down. Bandit, baby. It's the bandit. Banding together. Last pirate Whoa. dark wizard. This one's going to be towards Val. Seven does not hit. Nice. I love the idea of a deck wizard. <laughs> Pirate deck wizard. <laughs> Just a, they're different decks. Like, he's a poop deck wizard. He deals with press digitation. Bandit, uh, one of his crew does walk up and get a good slash across three earrings. Val, it is your turn. Oh, wait, Jake, I was this. wrong. It's not 13, it is 14. For 14. The safety C. Yeah. I think I still save on all of them, but yes. Yeah, well, there was one that you missed, but... Oh, was there? Yeah, it was... Yeah, but, but I had the one he re-rolled, yeah. 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 It is your turn, Val. Yep, I'm getting my lightning out. Because I will go into rage. Mm -hmm. Do your hill bonus action. Yep. I've got two lightnings up. Go ahead. You, you only had one up over here. It duplicated on my screen. Here. That's weird. There we go. Um, that is pretty, pretty so much. Do your hill action. I can only attack two more times because that. Only two more times. Mm. Oh shit. I, you know, okay, I'll take it. I oh, should have stayed 10 feet back and used the halberd, but fuck it. Um, I mean. Shoulda, woulda, so coulda. Eight, and you are not resistant to necrotic, correct? No, I am not. Um. So the 9 plus 2 is the two-handed, so that doesn't matter, but it's a 7 plus 3, which is 10. So 10 plus 4 is 14 for the first one. Um, 14. Total, that's after having. Okay. And the short sword of life-stealing uh, doesn't work, doesn't affect, because it's not a natural one. So just another 5 after that. It's not bad. I'm going to do the weak stuff first, so make a check. Uh, yeah. this <sighs> Dexterity check? Yep, doesn't matter. He takes one lightning damage no matter what. Because balls. Cause I'm balls. having to reload my GM layer, so give me a second. But make your attacks. Cause balls. Um, I have to feed my dog beer. But... Fuck it, we're gonna do great weapon master. And reckless. Okay. So he gets advantage that's, on all attacks against you. That's what Val would do. 14 does not hit. Does a 19 hit? 19 barely hits. Okay. 21 damage. Okay. Wow, my GM side is so damn laggy. Oh, we good? Might be good now. Um, is that your turn? Yeah, that's it. Mistress. No, oh, okay. that's not my turn, because I took haste, so I get one more attack. You do. But Mistress, you're on deck, and then... Soul. Did you never roll yes, initiative sir. for Exa? I did, he got no. a two, but I can't press his thing. Wow. One and a two. One second. Uh. So yeah, those do not hit. Mistress, it is your turn. Okay. Um, I'm going to as move. You run up here. to Lamuth after you rage. He slashes you twice, and you get a couple of licks in as well, but 
going to do thorn whip maybe normal 15 that does not hit okay um and then your oh you have what else are you doing um everyone's fine on health i'm not gonna be fine very soon you'll be fine you'll be right fine. now uh, Fear Spirit is going to run and then uh, uh, face step right behind him. Okay. And it's at fourth level. Okay, so two attacks. Yes. Miss 17 and hit. 29. Natty 29. 21 damage, right? 14 plus 9, 23 damage. Yeah, because the first one was at advantage, so that still would have been. Uh, that's that's it. Do. Yeah. Solanexa. Yes, sir. That's me, Solanexa. Um, I would like to rage. Um, I'd like to honestly kill him if that's possible but I don't think it is going to be so I'll cast a spell by the name of fireball at 18th level <laughs> yes 18th level <laughs> um hmm the vow lives cast. to his turn Shitter. What'd you say? Nothing. <laughs> oh, oh yeah. Um, Axe and Surge is fun when you get to use it against your players. The fucker. It was never against you. Hey. Um. Uh, sorry, I did think about this, but it's truly a bad situation for good old Julian Centron. Um. I'm going to cast a uh, vicious mockery you're gonna have to make a wisdom saving throw okay that i can do not the best at these that's what i was banking on that I... is a failure you take a good old five damage as i say <laughs> like into the wind so you can't he can't hear me but he still like takes psychic damage you'll never be as good as Val you suck for what you did that I totally remember um oh god mind, murdered one of my best friends in Minter's my trap. mind is a steel trap <laughs> um the X is gonna be like yeah good point you are terrible and then he is gonna cast a spell He's going to cast, well, if he's over there, hmm, how fast? Oh, he's at, he'll, he'll go like 15 feet closer, use his movement. Oh, I can do it now. Um, and then he'll cast Magic Missile at second level. And do you do it to where I have to ra roll, uh, right. roll for everyone? Roll 44. You're doing it for me. I'm just because it's easier than trying to explain it because it's a fucking stupid ass rule. <laughs> um, twelve, baby. Yeah. Points of force damage. Back to three earrings turn. Oh, I all well, of these things minimized. Oh, is that all you can do? Can. Sorry, I figured it was. Yeah, I'll soul move up a little bit. He moved. No bonus actions out of. Good the first sneak attack damage, she's going to finish him boy. off. This initiative oh, tracker is so long. Yeah. But I mean, it's a pirate shit crew, like. Yar har. Um. So, Oladim. Yep. You're in the middle of the group. Sure am. Sure am. Does a. Oh, that doesn't hit. Uh, so you take half of that, that's a nat one i don't think that should be anywhere close to me it's a 11 
Spells aren't at disadvantage. Disadvantage. Spells aren't. Twelve. Uh, six damage. Six more damage as arrow acid splashes next to you on the ship. I'm gonna die from just splash damage. <laughs> it's Every time I see pirate deck, I feel like it's this party deck. It is my turn. It is a party right. deck. These are just their. Uh, are are the. Uh, there's nowhere I can go to get. Man. Wait, where's. Is the Fear Spirit to the left there? Yes. It's like on the cool. railing behind him. That's oh, no, it's cool. that, it's giving that's... Val advantage, not you. Okay. You fine. can step up. I can get in Val's space. That is true. Step up on the railing, too, right? I'm not gonna try it. That's precarious. <laughs> that's, a, precarious. that's a deck save in the middle precarious. of the storm. That is that is very precarious. I, I will precarious. That's, that's technically precarious. that's where Lamuth is standing right now, right? No, he's just he hopped the railing and is just inside of it. All right, I'm going to go ahead and blow another key for this first one to be stunning, since I get advantage. <laughs> you are running out of key. <laughs> uh, I've used four and I have three left. Yeah. Because I'm not doing flurry of blows. Yeah, you're right. You're just because you're shadow stepping everywhere. Yep. So I'll take my three attacks here. Okay. First one being stunning strike. With Val, as you see, all of them emerge from the shadow between your legs. Just mockery do again. So not one on the last That's, one. Uh, no, it's not. Oh, I can't roll advantage. ones. That's a nat twenty. Okay, so two nat twenties, but that's only one stunning strike, right? Yes, the first one. What is Vicious Mockery so, doing in? Uh, disadvantage on his first That's attack. a fail. Oh. Okay. His second Indomitable. That is a success. Uh, there was only there, there was only one. Something yes, correct. but he has Indomitable. Oh yeah, so. Indomitable because he gets to re-roll it. Yeah, yep. you're right. Not just that he automatically saves. Yeah. Oh, wow, that is right on the success. So 14 18, plus 14. 22, 35. Okay. He's you were really in. putting in work, but I'm glad I wasn't all honorable, like, no, I'll take him, he's mine, fuck that. <laughs> and that's all you can do, right? Uh, I'm going to just uh, step a little bit out of Val's way. Okay. Let him have uh, <laughs> a wide berth. Okay. Uh, this pirate deck wizard is also going for you, all of them. They see who's causing the trouble. 11 does nope. not hit. Those are terrible, they're shit. They are shit. But everyone in this Action area dash. gets flashed, right? Yeah. Uh, so, no, just to you, it's only a five foot. So you still take the Jesus Christ. four acid take... damage. Okay. Especially if I take another six, I swear to God. And, Did everybody uh, see that bandit turn into a long boy really quick? Yeah, yeah, yeah. that was and really good. Man, you, why it. wasn't he like that? Honestly? So He just had his warlock moment. He's now a level one warlock. Wow. The first three are towards all of him. The last four are towards Val. Hold on. The, the first how many? Three are towards you. First three. Okay. Is he three dual what? wielding? Yes. No. He's oh, dual wielding no. oh, with a short sword. Holy mother of God, I am rolling like trash. No. Oh. Ah. Yes, sir. I rolled a three, one, and two. Yes, you, sir. You had some balls coming up you against us. You thought you could play, just come in and play the easiest class. Fuck Captain. him. I'm the La fighter. Hydration check. Captain oh. laughing my ass off. Had some balls. What's your AC, Val? Uh, I need you to roll all those with advantage. Oh, you're right. So that's one hit, two hits, and then two more with advantage. Well, not the first one, because the first oh. one has disadvantage, which would be normal. It would cancel but that was towards... Well, the that, first no, one towards... goes towards me. First one was towards him, so I actually oh, get one yeah, more yeah. Yeah, the first, Well, the first three were towards me. Yes, but the first one So really, one the first one. four would be towards you, because so the first one was at disadvantage. Yeah, does a 15 hit all of them? Wait, if it was at disadvantage... Yes, but that so means the no 13, natural one. 13 and 11 No, 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 were... no, 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 no I'll, I'll take the 13, 11, and 12. Nope. Okay? The 15 doesn't hit anyway. Okay, so yeah, you're fine. So the 27 so hits... 27 hits, a 24 is going to hit, but roll it again with advantage. Yep, just for crit vision. Uh, we're all clear uh, and then roll the I mean, third one. Yeah, third attack one, two, advantage. Just yeah, 
key it on. Yeah, that makes it so much easier. Yep, all three hit. And then the fourth attack. And then uh, his. He has seven attacks. Yeah. His off hands. Oh, that's true. Off hand. Yeah. All four hit. Technically, he shouldn't be able to do that. Why not? But I'll let it slide. Why shouldn't he be able to? Oh, I'll look up the rules for light weapons. Why does he can attack? Jimmy Crawford no, right he now. has the dual wield. He can attack well. with a light weapon with his offhand as a bonus action, but he can't add any modifiers weapons. to the damage. As long as he does, it's just a damage guy. Right. Unless so we he has that. Gate three. We know how this works. I have to oh, get a calculator out for this. I, I played play a dual wielder. And dragons. I also, I also play a dual wielder. Hey, look at. Played us. a dual wielder for a one shot. I know how the Maybe. rules. Yeah. No, I, I skimmed over the book on the weekend. <laughs> <laughs> I've played it once, maybe twice. So that's uh, thirty damage, Val. I read the SRD on the weekend, and that's thirty damage after being halved. I already did that math for you. So, did 30. we figure out his bonus action all hand attack? Yeah, it's, I looked up the rules before I started playing him. As long as I have the dual wielder feet, I can still right. action search. Okay, he has a dual wielder feet. All yes. right. Oh, do you have the dual wielder feet? Yeah, I have so many ASIs as a level 15 fighter. I know. Also, but... yeah, level 15 fighter. Easy to take down. Um. Also, that's two hydration checks now. And why is yeah, he using I'm a long sword to... and a short sword? That's on him. About to because shotgun this I water. like the aesthetic of it. <laughs> to have Soul. one longer sword than does the a other. Does a 16 hit? Does a 16 hit me? Yes. It doesn't when I cast shield. Okay, so a crossbow bolt comes towards you and you cast shield. <laughs> uh, this one is also what going towards all of them. I need to mark down my spell slots. And he's going to move a little bit this way. Spells can't crit. Spells can't crit. Spells can Spells crit. Can't crit. Spells can crit. Twenty-two acid damage. Enemy spells can't crit. <laughs> it wouldn't be a boss fight if you didn't sweat a little bit. I never sweat. I don't have the glands. I am a dog. He's dead. So Val, it's your turn. You know what we're gonna do? We're not gonna do great weapon master. Fuck it, we're gonna do great rub master. Hold on, I, I didn't have my headphones on. Did I get hit with that acid arrow? Yes, for 22 uh -huh. damage. For 22. For 22. It cool, critted. I'm at 8. It critted. I'm at 8 HP now. Uh, these are at advantage though, right? Because of flanking? Yes. I am so, mega ultra low. Not reckless. That does that not hit? hit? Nope. What was that? Another 14? Okay. This is not going to be great with Master. That does hit. That does not hit. Fucking my... Fuck. Oh, he is... A 25 does not hit? No, 25 no, does. The 16 25 does not hit. It's just, I can't roll... In general, at all, period. Uh, make a deck save, too. Well. <gasps> 2d4. Uh, Mel Sassadero on Mistress. Oh, okay. I thought that was the deck save. I was like, what no. the? <laughs> oh, there's just the first one, which is higher anyways. Yeah, he succeeds, so he takes three. Yep. <sighs> As he oh. turns into and just slices both of you more times than you've ever seen somebody attack at once. But Mistress, it's your turn. Nothing else that I can do. I don't have anything else. Did Yo, yeah, because you use bonus action. Did you... No, I'm just did looking at... with an arrow? Yes, you did. You got hit with an arrow last time. It just, the four damage is at the end of your turn. Uh, it's the, uh, like, residual, you get this much damage at uh, the end of your turn. Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> Fades into nothingness. Uh, <laughs> um, okay. So I'm gonna go right here. <gasps> I can't really go right here and help all of them, so I have to go right here. 
Yep. And gonna do. Am I though? What is it? The cube. Go off, sis. I can't because they're all concentration. Hey, was, I feel like the way that we have this guy surrounded, that no matter where anyone stands, it should be flanking, right? Pretty much at this point. Yeah. Okay. Nope. This is what we're doing. Change of course. Uh, In that we are case, going to mistress, do this. can you not? Thank you. <laughs> I mean, there's still one spot right here next to me. We're gonna do third oh. level no, cure wounds. Oh god, oh, yes. Oh, that's fine. <laughs> like, thank you, Jesus. On oh, Val. On uh, all of them. 14 hit points. On all, all of them. them! You heard it here. Bonus he action <laughs> bomb. <laughs> Bonus action bomb on top of that, okay. On uh, Val. Okay, how many dice? Dice? All of them? Die. All of them, guys? <laughs> all of them? Uh, 46. I'm not gonna lie, I feel like all of them needs it more, but... <laughs> no, no, use, use it on Val. It's fine. Uh, I, I, I can on... switch the two, Val can get the cure wounds. No, no, I planned on chugging a, a greater anyway. Okay. Because you get my extra action, so... Yeah. No, that's fine. Because I'm not going to do that it's at all. So, uh, it's it's the, literally, literally the same because you get 10 plus 4 temp. Literally. So 14. Literally. So, yeah. uh, Jake, that... have you been keeping count of how many rounds we've done? Mike yes, keep it keeps count for me. Okay. Okay. Uh, we are on, that might keep uh, me alive for one more round, which is all uh, we need. This is, I mean, you have 10 Fear rounds of this, you're at like round 3. Or, I, I just need to know for what I need to roll afterward. Oh yeah. No, I... Your spirit's going um, to... Um... Is going to poof to here, because... That's a poof. Cheese. Ah! There. That's a poof. That's Thank a poof. You. Why, why poof in there, though? Uh, To give someone advantage. To give Furious Spirit advantage, and to give someone else advantage. Which would be you. Yes, I have to. I have to move. No, you don't. No, you don't. You're I do. I, I right across. My, I want my advantage. Yes, no, you, oh. you, you get oh, flanking get advantage, advantage flanking. right where you're at. Yeah. Yeah, so you don't yeah, have to. You're right. right. You're right. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you're right. <laughs> you're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. You, you're right. Uh, so 17, Misses. which does not hit, and 23. Which does hit. Nice. Terrible. No, 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 nine damage is still good for just an extra action. Oh, it oh, is. I, know. I pressed the wrong one. I know, but it's also, terrible. Kill it. When the first one was 23. There we go. Sorry. Soul. It's also a crit. <gasps> I've been awakened. I'm gonna go right here. It looks lightning bolt. <laughs> yes, Look at sir. me. I healed a I'm whole bunch. I'm going past Jesus, lightning Lord, bolt at eighth level. Oh, okay. Um... That's oh, a good old. How many did we say? The 8d6 goes that. up one for each level. That's 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 13, 13d6. Are you actually going to cast Lightning Bolt at 8th level? Yeah, I have a wand. Um, yeah, he has wand to Lightning Bolt. R. Like, he's barely hurt. Okay. That's... Nah. <laughs> if you're going to go in, you're... go big. You yeah. gotta I mean, go big! Lightning bolt? Yes. Murder oh, the man. Five foot. Uh, so many ones. So, by the way, Soul, oh, this is you all very to. tight. Are you angling to hit all of them in battle? Just have or... no. Straight line. I'll take it. Five oh, foot by 100 feet. Five by 100 feet. Just so him. It doesn't oh, affect anybody on either side. Just Lamu. Okay. No, no. Yeah, because you, yeah, you got a straight line through there. But mind. it could have hit me that's if I stayed. Straight. It would have hit. Yeah, you that's why I said please don't do that. <laughs> and then you <laughs> left with your move, and I was like, thank you for not doing that. He is not looking good. I'd hope so. <laughs> Hexa's turn. Hi, I'm Exa. Um, uh, I. That doesn't feel like a thing to say. Oh, sorry. Um. Yeah, yeah. He jumps off the Russian ship. Um, <laughs> he, he doesn't have an accent. Um, no, but everything always ends up. <laughs> true. Um, Exo would like 
Rage. Right. <laughs> Every time I we say share that, two brain cells, I just <laughs> think do. about that. Um, you didn't even watch the first campaign. Hey, I I'll still share the brain cell. Yeah, hey. No. I at least get the brain cell on one weekend a month. <laughs> no. Um, I might be stretching. I'll cast magic missile at first level. Wow, the same exact amount of force damage. Um, and I'll move a little closer. I'll walk down the steps because X is civilized. Um, is he though? Oh, get the final kill! <laughs> uh, three earrings is going to take out one of these bandits. Oh, Fine, earrings, we got it. Don't turn around. I mean, she's it's okay. Problem. She's keeping she's attack economy off of you guys, so. I oh, know, it's fine. I'm joking. Stop um, killing the crew that we're gonna press in the service later. We're going to press them. Val, this is going towards you. Yeah, figured. My last acid arrow on these guys. A 22 does not hit. 13 acid damage. Oh, I also. Not... Yeah. Uh, Can it be poisoned instead? Nope. All of them, it's your turn. All right. And at Ooh, the end of your blow turn, the load here. I'm blowing the load here, boy. At the end of your turn, blowing you, load. you take he's another ten load. acid damage. Oh, so load! <laughs> we're going five attacks. Wait, first two like, being stunning. Okay, so I need two more con saves. Yep, rack them up, baby. One, two, three, four, five, twenty-two. Ooh, that last 15. one's not gonna hit. Nope. 15. So you have four hits. Six. You succeeded both. You hate to see it, but it's but a good amount of damage. It's gotta be enough. It's your boy, 39 it's, it's damage. Not enough. And have, not how enough. is that not enough? He's a how 15th deeper of a red level king get? fighter. Uh, how deeper of a red he can has get? The That's about as deep as a red as you can get. Beat, baby. <sighs> Balls. Hey, pirate deck wizard. Yep. Fuck off. Hey, soul. Yes, sir. How's up? No, wow. sir. One trick phonies. Uh, j they have other things, but that's just the most effective thing they have. That's probably. One trick phonies. Are they level five or level three? They're they're NPCs, so they don't have level three spells. They just have a bunch of level two spells. I'll just oh, look Lamuth in the eye and say, "You've got a lot of balls hunting us down after what we did to Barn." You've got a lot of balls. I'm gonna show him the the gloves that I'm wearing. Uh, so these are all four of these are going to be at uh, Uval. Uh, he does not have advantage. <laughs> Good thing he doesn't have advantage, yeah. right? Oh, hey, uh, can I? Shit, I know I know we're past my turn, but can I re-roll that last one because I did have lucky. I forgot uh, about it. Yeah, did you take your 10 acid damage as well, by the way? Oh, somebody in chat bought him it. Oh, okay. Yep, you can make that damage. Is that uh, fucking enough? Give me a second. Also, the cast just knocked something over. I, kind of I just... mean, even if, it, even if it's not enough, I kind of want <laughs> it to kill me just and you can throw it. Because I was trying to grab his attention. And tank some of the damage and let you get the kill because you've been hitting him and I haven't. I mean, the la these four attacks do all hit you, Val. They do. Well, seventeen. Was it enough? Yes. Uh, <laughs> we're gonna see if it's enough. Eleven is enough. Or if could old. No. Oh, the damage is enough. So I forgot to do that. It's my last turn too. So if you're redoing oh, something, I am. Oh, second win. Yeah. Uh, oh. Wait, what a second one did? He's, he's just... He's, yeah, you roll a d10 plus your I level. forgot to do it. I counted much. it into my economy, but I forgot to roll it. Last yeah. turn or this turn? Because then he would have gotten when one didn't, attack. Two turns oh. ago when he didn't take that bonus action. When he just got the... Uh... He was supposed to take it on his... I counted it off when all of them hit him and he ran away, but he couldn't use his bonus action because of having to hold his attack. Because mm. I wanted him to go against Val at full health. The He's still fucking low. Spiles back. Gold yeah, fetch. four hit. One's a grit. 
That's not all that. Which one is... I, I really need to stop marking things off of their character sheet before I use them, and just, you know... So much of this is halved. Um, 6 plus 19, or 6, 8, 15, 23, down, no, sorry. Come at me, lion boy. Uh, 34, Val. 34 total? Yes, 34 total. I'm still alive. Hell yeah. Uh, this bandit's going to attack three earrings real quick. That's our boy! I'm not even totaling that off, I'm just trusting Jake. No, I... Quick math, but... Math. Quick math. Oh, did you recall? Yeah. Hey. Uh, soul, this yeah, is against you. Uh, but I don't want it to be. Okay, six doesn't hit. It's the same thing. It's a, supposed to be a crossbow, but they have the same bonuses. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He needs a scimitar energy. <laughs> ah! <laughs> uh, <laughs> Why did you think that was going to hit? <laughs> uh, mistress. Last acid arrow I have at my disposal. Dismantle. Oh. After this, I'm done at first level spells. 23 damage, Mistress. Oh, no. Jesus Christ. I was just trying to be the one who. Val, it is your turn. Three attacks. Make him. I mean, if you do damage, you're going to kill him with your bonuses. Yeah, these are reckless. Do things. damage. Nice. Yeah, uh, the first damage. one was enough to kill him. Finally hit all three and it didn't matter. How do you want to do this? I will just recklessly, in a rage, with and lightning uh -oh. crackling into him. Just walk him off the edge of the ship. And uh, as he starts to fall, I'll tell him it's. Uh, Your ships are pressed against each other. I imagine they're. Well, I thought they were no, kind no. of bouncing back and forth a little bit. But. No, no, the grappling hooks pretty much attach to your ships to each other. Oh, uh, yeah. Plus, he probably has good stuff on him. Oh, my. That's my. Fine. I'm walking him back across the gangplank, just slashing him back onto his ship. So you slash him twice across the chest and drive the last one through his chest onto his ship and like pin him to the floor with your greatsword? Yeah. I need this is for Lilac. I need a dexterity saving throw from Oladim, Mistress, and the Furious Spiel it, Spirit. Spiel it. Spiel it. What kind Spiel of it. dexterity saving throw? Spiel it great. Nope, it's not that. No, but that's going into him too. Yep, that's fair. Uh Fury Spirit? Yep, Fury Spirit, Mistress. <laughs> oh, um. So. Dex save. Mad Boy. Ooh. He do be saving, though. He do be, though. Uh, no, the, Dex mean... the Fury Spirit does not save, Mistress does not save, and. Uh, to be fair, I have a lot of movement speed. Can I work him like back to Nope. Uh, do be. Twenty-four save. Yes, a twenty-four does save DC twenty. And that's oh, wow. no damage, baby. Uh, well, as Val drives the great sword through Lamuth and pins him to the deck, you do see a massive. 10 foot wide bolt of lightning strike him from the sky above and the deck below him splinters and the shockwave spreads out to all of you. So wow. I take the 15? You do take the 15. Okay. That kill you? Nope, she's at one. Uh. <laughs> Jesus Christ, that's so close. Fuck! Um, Val. Yeah? You hear a voice in the back of your head. <laughs> and as you look down at your greatsword in your hands, you see it's been changed. The pommel it ha holds a dull sapphire, and the blade is rippling with electricity. This is slightly it. glowing. I did kind of start bouncing the material a little bit. Um, 
as you pull it up from his body, you do see light runes across the blade of it. But you're all still in combat, so you can inspect that later. Mistress, it's your turn. Can I, as a free action, yell something? Yeah. <sighs> he was the strongest on this ship. Who else wants some? Make an Are you going to lay down your weapons and surrender? Intimidation with advantage. He did kill most of them. It'd be wild. <laughs> <laughs> like, even, even just, yeah, just three earrings took out four. Nice. Good advantage. The double fours. Them That's double fine. We'll just murder them all. It's maybe. Cool. We'll kill them all. It's okay. You do actually see that is enough. It was a low DC. You did just kill their captain. And lightning just struck around you as you're holding up a rippling greatsword. DC 10. Um, the, Almost not, no. Also, there are mages left who have burned all of their good spells. So They're wiped. Yeah. They're going to put their hands up and drop spell books or whatever focus they were having. Out their acid arrows? Uh, you use... <laughs> what do you use for this all campaign? Do you use D&D Beyond? I do, yeah. Okay. Um, I cannot add this to your inventory because I am not the. Uh, mistress, would you like a greater potion? Is it a item that you I'm made just, or not? Yes, in? I'm just gonna send you a screenshot of it. Okay. Just send it to me and I can add it. Oh yeah, do that. Would you like a greater? No, I'm fine. Chug down. No. Just add that to his inventory. Um, I don't like that music. Okay, the storm still rages on, but Rose Jackler. I forgot to. I forgot to open Barney. <laughs> um, it's still heavily raining, but not nearly as bad. The ship's still. The fighters on deck slowly drop their weapons or whatever they are using and go to their knees. Hands up. Huh. What are you guys doing? Val, you are still ship, raging. Boys. Unless you're not. Yeah, no, I'm still raging. Um, Exo will go over to Mistress and be like, you've done so much for us. And will cast uh, healing, uh, Cure Wounds at second level. Healing wounds. Why are you healing being wounds. so sappy? Healing wounds. I just healed myself. I'm fine. Oh, I didn't know that. He wants to touch you. Nine. Play. <laughs> I mean, I his worst. Just the most. Yeah. Uh, ben just texted me and said to do that, so it's not. <laughs> no. Um. I don't know. It. He has more spells. <laughs> you get topped off. It's alright. Yeah. Uh, plus his intelligence, which is four, so thirteen, baby. Um, I hate to burn misses. And I, I me and Exo, will help loot the ship. Um, and he'll get me a to join an investigation. Uh, three trip. earrings will get back up and like hold her chest. That was a uh, rather unexpected. The storm over the next ten to fifteen minutes will completely dissolve away to a gentle light rain. We'll give Val what are you guys doing? 10 hit points because you're super hurt, right Val? <laughs> I'm yeah. down to 4. Yeah, he'll give you 10 hit points. Getting rid of your lightning. Yeah, thank you. Um, yeah, I know. And... I nearly died. Make a little investigation check. You were X that. giving me advantage. Can I uh, loot his body? Uh, make an investigation check. Obviously, yeah. the two swords are there. Ravage his body. <laughs> wow, jeez. <laughs> um, you find the two swords and about ten copper, or sorry, ten platinum, but. Not, I mean, his armor is nice, but not magical. His, uh, he's not like it's all Concord issued stuff. The main things he had were the long sword of wounding and the short sword of life stealing. Yes, 
Um, and I checked the rest of the ship. Did I find anything? Of no. Did you investigation? Uh, nineteen. Yes. You find a quite sizable uh, lockbox full of money. Yeah. Oh, how many rounds did we go through? Uh, you went through three full rounds. By the time you probably could end it, it was four. So make DC 18 constitution saving throws. Okay. Um, bet. Jesus. <laughs> Easy. Roll. Chuck's dice. Nice. <laughs> the animation for me was just like the fastest dice on roll 20 I've ever seen go across the screen. <laughs> he was okay. like, bet. I was making sure I didn't get advantage on con checks for raging. Uh, also, these potions are great. Smaller <laughs> bet. <laughs> I want you to write a letter right now, attach it to a pigeon, I don't care how, stab it with a dagger, and throw the pigeon back at that guy. We want 50 more. <laughs> They're amazing. <laughs> Wait, you want me to stab the pigeon and then throw it into the ocean? I don't Why? care. Get the best he's on a high. He's on a high. A you need to come down, Val. That won't work logically. <laughs> Well, we can try it, man. We can fucking try. No. I think Axel will agree with me, right, Axel? Yeah, that won't work. That was that was actually pretty convincing for Axel. <laughs> that was, yeah, good job. Thanks. <laughs> I need more speed. What did you uh, find in the logbox? Because I didn't hear that part. Uh, uh, I think he's typing it to me. 11, or... You want me to type it to you or just say it out loud? You don't have to. I'm going to split it evenly, I I'll swear. I'll just put it in chat then. <laughs> 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 I swear, I'm not going to steal all the gold out of them. Me and X. <laughs> me and X are the two people with like zero money. No, no, he's fine. He has that's what was in the lockbox. Oh, wow. That's a. Oh, that's oh a my gosh. Code. It's 12. <laughs> Ooh, silver piece. Twelve oosps. Oosp. <laughs> we got twelve oosps, guys. It's twelve oosps. And um, seventy pp. Ooh, seventy pp. Was that an investigation check for the whole ship? Uh, yeah. I would like to intimidate know. some of this crew into telling me if there's any more hidden. No magic items or anything like that. Just checking, rounding my bases, checking my bases. Um, can I intimidate the crew? Make an intimidation with advantage. I mean, Spooky. after what just happened? I mean, yeah, that's why you have advantage. 23, uh, they, like, neatly hold up, like, wands. Uh, this is, this is technically magic, but not unless you can use magic. That's not a thing! Then, no, there's Chuck nothing else here I know of piece of coal. Uh, one of them will mention that they do have like two tankards of never the never spilling tankards. Hand those over. On the captain it's in the captain's room. They just look like normal tankards unless you grab them though, so they are or so wouldn't have really like Hi I'm Jay uh, uh oh yeah the never spilling tankards are probably to uh can I intimidate them into telling us Fine. where they were headed? What their mission was? Uh, what does your make, your, check with, do? make your intimidation check. Alright. I'm going to unconsciously make the sword crackle with electricity. Okay. Well, I, I think you're consciously doing that now. I'm holding it. <laughs> uh, but I don't know it can do that yet. No. Wait. As the sword... Yeah, you don't. I just sent it to you. 12,000 silver pieces? 12,000. I rolled all six. I rolled like... Yeah, I rolled 2d6 and got six on both of them. So much <laughs> silver. Whoa. Wait. We could kill so many werewolves, guys. That is... Wait, is that correct? Total... Yes. It is correct. I'll, uh, I'll transfer that just to PP for you. Okay, yeah. Um, here's... No, I I got the money. That's two hundred twenty copper, four thousand four hundred silver. Oh, how many of those? There's five of those, right? Slow platinum. down. Hang on. Back up. That's two hundred and twenty copper. There's two five of those, right? right? Two. Yes, sir. Okay, two thousand. Oh. There's nine hundred eighty-two gold. Technically, more than two five. silver for everyone. Nine hundred eighty-two. Yeah, are you splitting this between three earrings and two or? 
I will handle that later. Yeah, 982 gold, 2 silver, if we're splitting it 5 ways. Okay. Gold. That works. Yep. And I'll handle... I'll handle three rings later. Nine hundred. Nine hundred eighty-two. <laughs> okay. Uh, one of Nine. them will pop up. Uh, with the twenty-three and twenty-two intimidations back to back. Uh, I don't know if there's anything in there, but he does have a liquor cabinet that we're not allowed to touch. Classic. We're going through that. Uh, so if you go to the liquor cabinet, because those were good intimidation rolls, uh, just a couple fine bottles of whiskey and rum, and there is, um, one potion bottle in there of gaseous form. I'm just going to tell you because Sol will in identify them. Mm -hmm. Uh, there is what looks to be a very nice decanter, and, uh, a small sack in the back with a couple beads in it. Is there also an aerator for the fancy wine? Uh, no, there is not. Damn it. Uh, we are not scum like Sam Regal. <laughs> uh, that, that is a joke for anybody. You're Sam so Regal. aggressive towards Sam Regal. No, uh, Sam Regal's probably one of my favorites. Yeah, he's a good man. Um, well, I wasn't expecting to do that tonight. <laughs> no. Neither was good old me. Oh my gosh. Benjamin, I'm sorry. <laughs> We're rolling at ninety-one. Uh, do we want? Do we want the ship? Uh, it's uh, an upgrade. No, uh, it's not. Do we want the ship? Do Just three you want, want the ship. ship? Well, that's the thing. Uh, I'm uh, asking y'all before we get to earrings. Look, like, do we want our ship? Do we, we want our? Well, <sighs> we could. And I thought about that, but. It might it's serve better for what butts. they do. Yeah. Smaller ships serve the what she does a little better. But yeah, well, why don't we take it to her and let her decide? Yeah. Well, the thing is, I think the ship is a little too big for just us. But just we can us. work this into a ship of our own. We can make a trade, basically. Like we can take oh. this somewhere and get our own ship for it. And also, if we're heading into the Feywild, how? much longer can we actually keep up with the ship well that's the thing we can have a ship docked somewhere safe with our name on it you just pay a small fee for you know harbor for fee. however long we might be gone that or we could hire a crew and have them make money for us we have options like we're headed sounds like a lot we're headed towards the place where this is a possibility uh, It'll probably broken bank, Bisseft Isles. It might add a day or two to your travel, but it's possible. Like if we wanted to hire out a crew on Bisseft Isles, and they don't even have to do anything illegal, they can just do regular right. shipping runs for us. We pay them a small amount, and then we take the rest for ourselves. I'm not doing Orly's voice. <laughs> um, it's a possibility. We're gonna extend our time traveling there. I think voice that is. Am well, I, we have to I go. Think we leave this option up to Mistress. Then we have to go past the Bisseft Isles, no matter what. But Mistress, what do you think? It would cut I... into getting there quicker. I think we figure out this next week. <gasps> nice! <laughs> Fade away. <laughs> Credits oh, roll. <laughs> yeah, it's 11. Who are we raiding? Well, I think we figure this Mistress, out next week on d, d While we think over this, there is something I want to tell you. Oh! Another cliffhanger? I wouldn't have been able to do this without my family. And that, that includes all of you. Okay. You made us part of your clan, but... You were all also part of my crew, and I couldn't have done this without any of you. I give you a hug. I'm going to roll a strength check, because I'm going to lift you in the air. 
I would say not doable, but this is mysteries, so it's actually doable. <laughs> Thank you, Sting. Hope oh. you enjoyed. <laughs> yeah, uh, Val, she really squeezes you tight and lifts you up. <laughs> I'm a little surprised, I'll, but... In your fragile I'll, state, you probably actually hurt a little, because you are bruised and cut to hell. <laughs> I'll adjust density so it's weirdly high. It's I'll, like, I'll tie in, a, I'll tie in a, a third level cure wounds in my hug. Um, <laughs> I adjust density so she's like holding him above her head, like fully. <laughs> just Wait, like, like, what the... It, it, it matters. Are you making him lighter or her heavier? Her him lighter. Okay, yeah, so, Val, <laughs> when you go to pick him up, is surprisingly light. Sorry for an orc, right? Don't call me fat. Uh, you do heal, but it is a strange feeling of you can't breathe because your lungs are being squeezed, your ribs are being squeezed so tight, but, like, a lot of your cuts do, like, Oh, close. that's a good heal! That's a really good <laughs> right? <I'm bad. laughs> My lungs are being squeezed. Get that deep tissue massage. <laughs> Well, Val, you all enjoy. you're so light. I need to feed you more. <laughs> you do. Get to cooking. All right. We are going to raid... Uh, Adam Gandalf. We're just oh, going to quit right there. Whiskey. I mean, it's 11. No, That's a good I can place cancel to pick it. Up. I was... Just... How much? Is... How long has she been? She's been going for six hours, but... Whiskey's only is... been going for two and a half. Well, let's... Whiskey's probably going to be on longer. Well, let's let's go do whiskey. Okay. Thank you all for tuning in. Not Somebody. <laughs> no, it was on the there, but it, it went to Madam anyway. That was Madam. a great raid. Whiskey. Yeah. One of our. Oh, thank you, Ziskin. Yes, last hydration check of the night. Chug, okay. chug, chug. Good night. Good night. Thanks for watching. Come back Tuesday. Come back Tuesday. And Saturday. Don't come back Tuesday. Well, Tuesday, Saturday, Saturday, next Sunday. Whoa, jeez. Is it your penis?